Hello and welcome back to the Lost the Crown of the Magister. The last stream, which was cut slightly short because of technical issues, but not too much. It was still about a four hour stream. We had ventured into the mountains, found a strange wizard's tower, which was headed by a copper, probably, dragon. I don't know how dragons work in the Solasta universe, but a dragon of some metallic kind. We fought more of those defilers, the annoying vampire creatures. And in the end, we got the Abjuration Gem, which means that we now have three gems in this crown. The Transmutation, Necromancy, and Abjuration. We also got quite a few fancy, fancy magic items. Some of which we bought. Some of which we bought. Some of which we got. And overall, we came out pretty well in that. I believe we got braces of archery from them as well. Got the ring, got the cloak. We got a lot. We have to tune to this necklace on our next rest, but... Yes. It was all in all a very... Uh, well, fun time, but also... I hate those vampire things. They can all die. I hate them. We've also been crafting scrolls and stuff as well. And I did figure out this chest thing for any curious. It's very strange and very annoying. Like, for instance, this, you can't do this. You have to drop. And it goes into the stash for some reason. So right click drop puts it in and opens up a new row. Very strange. Very annoying. I don't think we... This is still... Yeah. That gem is not... Or that thing is not done yet. Just gonna move around this gem, give it to her. She has a lot of stuff on her. All for crafting, probably. Yes. A doom gem. Yeah, we have to look into crafting more magical weapons, but for now, we had... That's not the right button. This is... Yes, we had to go to the council and make a report we also have a treasure map to go to there's a quest we can go to the manicalan ruin which we're probably going to do because ring of necrotic resistance is pretty nice especially considering it seems like vampires and undead are going to be a major enemy this was back to the fortress the dragon's fortress and we're doing that because level 5 spell scrolls, but that's a level 8 quest, so maybe we'll hold off on that for a second. And we need to go back to the monastery, but first things first, we have to check out this billboard. This is the Scavengers. Oracle, Tamarian Ruins. So they're going out to these two places. And should get loot. Hmm. Yeah, I'm already with selling it. 200 gold, more or less. That's pretty good. This is lovely music. I hope it's not too loud. It's, um. It's a wee bit loud to me. But. I, know, I just keep messing with the master volume and it seems to work. But yes, we will now go to... The council. 
I'm just taking the long way because, I don't know, it's a pretty game. I like looking at it. I'm also going to try to not whip it around as much, the camera. That's a bad habit. <laughs> Honorable members of the council, please be seated. The Legacy Council is now in session. Lord Keenmind has the floor. Honorable members of the council, we at the Arcanium have gathered crucial information about this crown. This is indeed the crown of the Magister, belonging to Kaysenax, eternal soul of the Eight Traditions, ninth and last Magister of the Manakelan Arcanium. At the time, there were eight masters of magic, one for each of the old schools. In time of need, each master lent their gem to the Magister, the head of the Arcanium. Placed in the crown, they granted additional powers that enabled the Magister to cast spells or perform rituals of incredible power, such as the closing of the Rift from Tirmar. Indeed, now, there is some debate about whether the crown with all its gems could possibly open another rift, or even reopen the previous one. Nonsense. The rift has been closed for a millennium. So Lasta paid a high enough price for that. Have you been to the Badlands recently? Order! Marshal Sunblaze has the floor. For our part, now that the existence of Sora Akath on Celasta has been confirmed, we have gathered proof that they are operating everywhere in the Eastern Kingdoms, including here, in the Principality of Mazgarth. Impossible! The Soraks are looking for the crown and its gems. That cannot be a coincidence. A powerful artifact, certainly. But reopening the rift? It took all the gods of Tirmar to open it. No one knows for sure what the crown can do. It's just a theory. As you know, it protects itself from our divination spells. That is one of its mysterious powers. Then why would the Sorax think they know better? Because they're Sorax. Their foul god, Sortar, knows. He is guiding them. We try to leave him. And them behind on Tirmar. It seems we failed. Their people, their culture, they must have been obsessing about this for a thousand years. While we spent that time fighting each other, they had to stick together and hide to survive. Fables and conjectures. Perhaps. But can we take the risk? The crown must be secured. The crown belongs to those who found it. Those are the rules. The quest for the gems should be completed. Only this way can we learn more about the crown and its powers. These deputies, well, they're not strong enough. No offense. Tell that to the crown. And they've done well enough so far, wouldn't you say? This is nonsense. Maybe the deputies would like to speak. After all, they are members of the council now, aren't they? Yeah, I'm gonna kick your ass, little guy. We might be not strong enough to take on the bad guys. Strong enough to take you on. He's really annoying. I don't like him. Uh... Yes, let's be semi-diplomatic. We will be able to continue searching for the gems. Hmm. Confidence. I like that. Preposterous! Shut up. Five more gems to find. Do you even have a lead? Yes, the best lead possible. The crown itself tells us where to go. The Sorax will come after you. You know that. But you have our complete support in this struggle. Our thanks, Marshal. If that is all, may we conclude? I'd like to say a word, if that is appropriate. Of course, Your Highness. We're listening. I think our brave deputies shouldn't be, you know, sleeping in a city inn. We have a very comfortable residence near the palace. They would be safer there, don't you think? That would be my 
I mean, our part in supporting the quest. <clears throat> your Highness, I must remind you that your decisions as head of state are not subject to council approval. Oh, right. Might I suggest that you reiterate your offer outside these walls? Of course. I beg the council's pardon. Not at all, your highness. Then I think that is all? Thank you. The Legacy Council is now in recess. I don't know if I trust the princess fully. It's a little she's a little weird. A word, please, deputies. Sure. Her Royal sure. Highness asked me to reiterate her offer to accommodate you at the palace residence. I'm, I'm not sure what that is. A house for plenipotentiaries, emissaries, and other guests of the court. Sounds nice. You don't say. Where is this residence? In the palace. Ask for Ravensworth, a royal butler. He'll show you. Stay in the light, senior deputies. You too, Captain. The law is the law. New quest. Heritage of Distrust. We got an achievement. Climbing the ranks. Guessing that's get a house. Path to glory is go to the court, speak to the butler, go to our house, or our quarters, I should say. Old acquaintance needs help tracking corruption with the city guard. And the mayor wants to talk to us. Nope, oh, my keys are... Fingers are on the wrong keys. Yeah, I don't trust the princess. She wants us to be awfully close to her. She's very strange. Okay, let's talk to the mayor then. Finally, she wants to talk to us, now that we're important. Lady Brightspark, how may we help you? You could start by not calling me that. As you wish. I have a messy business on my desk, and your name's on it. My name? It's an inheritance, with a bunch of people contesting the will. What? Who died? The Honorable Jane Tannison. Oh, I see. Family? She was... my mentor. A renowned lawyer. Lawyer? You're a lawyer. Do I look like a lawyer? Wouldn't put it past you. What is this mess, exactly? Tannison left you everything, according to the will. Her children aren't happy, and the notary is very annoying. So please, do something. Anything. Just make them stop harassing me. I have more important things to deal with. Perhaps I should talk to the children first. Do whatever you want, as long as it shuts this notary up. Right. Thank you, my lady. Okay. Inheritance. Drew Lyria. Uh, maybe we should. Maybe let's do this. Let's do this one. So there are. We can talk to Drew Lyria and Audria and Stig as well down there. Now let's do this one. This is a, a side quest. Let's do the side quests first. So how much coin do we have? Seven, seven sixty-seven. Lyria, I'm so very sorry for your loss. Oh, you're that... Well, I knew she liked you, but... Frankly, this all seems like a prank. She a valley girl. Right? That's what I told the notary. Yeah, okay. Goodbye. Okay. Also, what's with that shot of basket? These people. She's just a valley girl elf. Okay. <laughs> sure. That was so unhelpful. Thank you. All right, here we are. True. 
Are you going to have more to say? Drew, how are you holding up? Oh, look, it's the famous heir. Oh, he's Fred a dick. Bow. Okay. Listen, I have no idea. Oh, of course. It's just bad luck that you got everything. Can we talk? What are just with talk these? To my lawyer. Oh, wait. What? Okay, this is weird. He needs a smack in the mouth. He's grieving. I'll give him something to grieve over. <laughs> okay. Damn, Thorak. Okay. And the last of the children. I don't know. Children are all ditzy or dickheads. Honestly, so. Adria, how are you? Well, sad, of course. You? Thanks for asking. A bit down, of course. <laughs> she taught me so much. I know. She was proud of you. Thank you. Listen, this will, it, it bothers me. I really don't want to quarrel with you and your siblings. I'm afraid you won't have a choice. Lyria is a lying bitch, and Drew is a tactless jerk. Huh. What would you do with the Well. Emergence? Me? I'd share it with the other two sharks, just to stay alive. Fair enough. Tannerson Estate. A new area is available. Oh, do we have to leave the city to do it? Uh oh. Uh, our destination is blocked. Where am I? I am over here. There we are. Okay. Uh, we might as well talk to the guard while we're at it. Hey, shorty. You in the army? Don't call me that. I'm a royal guard, you know. You're a dwarf. You don't have much room to speak, <laughs> Thorak. The princess and all. Yeah. Those your friends? We are. How do you know each other? Oh, I see. They didn't tell them? Oh, I get it. We were in the city guard together. That's right. And uh, we both um, upgraded. Anyway, I need help. I think someone's rotten in the guard. That's reassuring. We have important things to do, mind you. Hey, Stig is my friend. Fine. I need to go. Meet me at the palace entrance when you have time. I don't think we can leave. It's Tannerson Estate. But I can't go there. I think it's out of the city. I don't think they're going to let me out of the city. Not yet, at least. Not until... Uh... Yeah, not until we deal with the main quest and such. I mean, maybe we could, but we might as well go... We might as well. Let's help him out. Yeah, I forgot that my character was a city guardsman. Hey, Stig. Hey there. You ready? Sure. So, what can we do to help? I have four suspects. Here are their names and posts. It won't be easy. They mustn't know I suspect them. We'll check them out. No problem. Strike true. I do love... Thorax swanky armor. Hers too. But look at him. That. That's a unit right there. Also they did in one of the patch notes. They fixed the beard. Because apparently that was a problem. As we saw. One specific beard on one dwarven face. Which happened to be ours. Temple quarter... Snow Alliance, a drunk, and the bridge. 
Okay. Let's begin up at the Snow Alliance, shall we? This is very classic D and D quests. Root out the corruption, the guard, and also the other quests deal with some rich dead person's kids. I've had to deal with that in a D and D game before. The Chris inheritance. Guys. I know you. You're the Sorak killers. Not the voice Anything I'd expect. To share? Off the books. Okay, getting what? right to it. Okay. A little business of yours. Oh, 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 sure, sure. Not here, though. Meet me at the promontory tonight. Okay. It's probably something very... Uh, innocent. Maybe a bit weird, but probably nothing too bad. I get up there is the other one. Yes. Let's just knock through them real quick. Maybe. Here? No. Temple Quarter was one, but there's no thing over his head. Okay, let's go down here. Talk to the drunk guy. Private Garth. Oh, okay. Thorak? Okay. Just running along the wall. Clear skies. This is my seat. I always sit here. What? Okay, so he's... Oh, no, we can talk to him again. <laughs> can we talk? You're a strange bunch. You know that. Even stranger than that Arwen Merton. Fair enough. Again? Okay. Just keep trying. Are you going to say something? You it! You council pawns are fake. Killed Sorax. Right. And I've got a dragon in my pocket. Now you're pissing me off. Are right, we gonna have to fight him? Well, I'm not sure he's even smart enough to be corrupt. Think he can work? He could barely stand. Let's go and see then. Go to the Sunblaze Court. Back up here we go. Yes, there he is. Garth. This fast travel is pretty handy, to be honest. I do like it a lot. Very tired today. I don't know why. Flowers. What's he doing? Hijacking a crate from a delivery. Let's see what's in it. I mean, just a bunch of flowers from the looks of it. Flowers? Angry violets. Oh, Hundreds of them. That's right, the alchemical Why? ingredient. What are you doing? <laughs> um. Sure. The question is, what are you doing? My Turn job. it back to him. What did you think I was doing? Why did you pick this crate out of the delivery? Oh, this one. Huh, let me think. This is for Her Royal Highness, going through Captain Ironshell directly. Oh, I'm sure the princess will appreciate you ramaging her personal stuff. As everyone knows, everything for her personal use is tax-free. I knew that. Ask the captain. Go right ahead. That won't be necessary. Carry on. All right. So unless he's the best liar in existence, yeah, he's probably fine. They're pretty and all. Those are also alchemical ingredients, aren't they? Yeah, they're for like... 
I mean, I guess they are common. They're not exactly expensive. They're not rare, so... It's still weird why she needs that much. That so many of them. Uh, Market Street. Yeah, let's go. I don't know. I just don't trust this princess, to be entirely honest. Not slightest. So there's something about the temple quarter. Also, one second. Just had to adjust a uh, couple things real quick. Roderick, he's on an errand. Roderick isn't here. Okay, can I find him on this? Roderick. Nope, that's uh, Co. I know it's it's Arwen Merton, but it's also Co. Hmm. Nope, I don't know where he it is. It's probably a clue. Nope. Okay then, let's go down here. Investigate Corporal Dan. Lieutenant Dan. Corporal, I don't know which one's higher. Corporal or Lieutenant. Alright, Stig says he should be leaving soon. There he goes. L let him get a head start. Oh lord. Yeah, okay, we're good. For whatever reason... My computer just spazzed out. My second monitor just freaked. Should be cautious. Look how far the sound goes, considering that half of us are in plate. I will, I'm in plate. She's in half plate. And we have a collective plus one with disadvantage stealth between us. So... Stealth is not the option. He's probably going to meet a pretty lady. Which looks like exactly what he's doing. Why he's got a sword out, though, I don't know. Oh, yeah, he's definitely just meeting a pretty lady. Now that's a conspiracy. There might be an angry husband. It might be worth an arrest. Shut up. <laughs> Shut your mouth. So now we have only Roderick, but we don't know where he is. That is the main thing. I'm not entirely sure where we go to get to him. Because he's not around here. So, couldn't say. Roderick isn't here. Roderick isn't here. Do you think maybe he comes by later? Hmm. Well, we'll uh we'll come back. Let's go to our quarters. At the very least we can pass time until nighttime.
Should we go talk to him again? Is he anything new to say to us? Aura of protection and aura of truth. Your rooms are ready. Yeah, sure. Also, the uh, the crown has eight gems. I thought it was seven. I didn't see the big middle one atop. But there are eight schools of magic. Classically. You. I know you. What? Oh. You oh, are yeah. at the embassy. An aide or something? You're mistaken. I'm a council deputy. You can't fool me. I never forget a face. What's going on, friend? Did he, did he try to rob him or something? That same week, the Galavan envoy somehow got hold of our plans for the trade treaty. Stop bothering us. We're guests of the princess. He's a Belmont. Be careful. They're a powerful family in the Snow Alliance. This isn't over. Now I found you. We'll settle this. All right. Come at us. Anything we should know? Old story. Look, if this is going to be a problem, we need to fix it. Together. I agree. All right. Then I'll need to see someone at the Galavan Embassy. <laughs> Rogue's gonna rogue. It's quite pretty, though. Very fancy. Look at the tiles and everything. Saw something we can grab. What's in here? Oh, I see. These are... Those are where we are, but what is this? It's our stash. No, it's a chest. Ooh. Oh. Hello there. So she's going to attune those. She can have... 19 strength as well. Okay. So level 8, 1 in a con, 1 in a wisdom, then we can use the book. Magnificent dagger. Metallic headband. Definitely magical. Let's put that in here. Magnificent leather. What does he have? Studded leather. So it's about all the same, isn't it? My monitor went out again. Bitch. I assume I'm still recording and such. Everything just freaked the fuck out. That's gonna be... Just give me one second to put everything back. Christ. I don't know why that's happening. If it happens again, I have to. I will have to investigate. It's annoying. So magnificent leather. It's basically the same. Well, actually, no. I'll. I can spend some time. No, we're not in a huge rush. Yeah, identify. Identify. Let's start with the headband. Headband of intellect, maybe. I was right. The question is, you know, who actually wants to wear this? I guess it could be him. It would give him better investigation, which is, you know, used in uh, trap finding. Also, he... Yeah, I'll have to do that. Also, he has proficiency in intelligence saves. So that would give him a plus eight to his int save, which is pretty good. Mm. While we're at it, just pop these armors real quick. In about half an hour, it's fine. Leather armor plus one. And probably a breastplate plus one. Perfect. 
Well, I might actually give that to him. Breastplate, AC to 15, plus 2 dex. 16. So, it's worse than hers. So that one we can actually sell. Because we have half plate plus 1. And we don't really care about stealth disadvantage for her. She's not going to be good at stealthing anyway. But we have three items to attune to now over the course of the next rest. Is there anything else in here? Anything else fun? Oh, no. Damn. Okay. They're not going to let us. Hmm. Let's wait. She crafted the scroll and our healing remedy. Very good. And the arrow. What time is it? It is nighttime. So I actually want to wait. First, though, I think we should actually take a short rest, though. So we can attune to an item. Attune to this. Got an achievement for attuning max items. You, these gauntlets, and you, the headband of intellect. And nothing for you. Perfect. So now everyone's suited up. She has 14 more max health, which is pretty good. She's a wizard with 19 con. Gotta love it. Her strength is big. So now when we do use her mace, she can do very well with it. And now we have a, a smart boy. Doesn't matter too much for him, but... So is that all for the main quest? I don't know, we have to we probably have to rest first. We have to actually rest to do it. Oh well, we'll do this guard quest real quick. Yeah, apparently the Salasa people are releasing books and PDFs with all of their custom stuff, which I'm very excited for. Because I am absolutely putting some of these subclasses and stuff into my game. And some of these feats, too. That cantrip feat is awesome. Oh. New locations, new quests. The Cradle of Fire and Mind of Master. One to the volcano, one to the lava forest. Okay. Hmm. That sounds... Ugh. Now. There's him. I still don't know where this Roderick is. I might honestly have to look it up unless he's somewhere else, like in the embassy. It's probably him that's messed up. What was that? Are those just alcohol? Quiet place. I like it. So, what have you got? In a rush, eh? All right, here. Booze? Really? Hey, you asked for it. My boss would kill me for selling new Empire liquor. This isn't illegal. Of course not. Just, you know, Imperial. Slaver stuff. Oh, never mind. Our mistake. Sorry to waste your time. Chair. My chair just fucking tried to kill me. Well, so it is Roderick, wherever the fuck he is. I don't suppose I can go anywhere. Nope. Fancy, though. Nice morning star. Huh. 
What is the Galavan Embassy? Oh, finally. Oh, I see. It's waiting to the last because he's the guilty one. Nothing. We're wasting our time. This Roderick, though. Where is he? Let's check again. Uh, I see him right there, and he has a scimitar. Or, no, it's a falchion. You're Plus, Roderick. Not drawn now, but it was. Who's asking? We're council deputies. What the fuck? Oh, he's cast them. What was that? He's not just a guard, that's for sure. That's a shadow caster trick. He can't be far. Look for tracks. You know, I can't help but wonder. No, I have it prepared. Why couldn't he was very obvious? Couldn't we have just spelled? I see. He just went. I think he just went invisible, or he teleported and then just ran, you know, thirty feet and then just run like hell into the sewers. Secret tunnel. We're onto something here. Secret tunnel. I mean, I wouldn't call it a secret. It's just the sewers. But ooh, what's this? That looks like more than just a sewer. There's some cult shit going on down here. Let's be cautious. And well, as long as everyone is within 10 feet of Thorak, we should be fine. I almost want to light these, though, along my way. Actually, if we go back, hit them with... No. Someone has Shimmer. Right? No. Oh, she did the elf. Yeah, alright. I know it probably doesn't make a difference. I just kind of want to light them. Kind of fun. Thug. Hello, Roderick. Can't say I'm surprised. I intentionally did that because. I didn't want to start a fight if they were going to be good guys. Invisible shadow murder. Ow, you bitch. Okay. Fine, retaliation. Sneak attack. You know, you Just have... bad luck. You have to hit first, though, to do it. Okay. How about we step back a bit? Yeah. Okay, here we go. What is Ice Storm? Ice Storm is a big cone of... Actually, a big, big cone. We can get three. I don't suppose this would... No, we can get three at most, okay. Now, what does it even do? Hold on. Difficult terrain and damage. Okay, that'll do. Oh, victory is mine. Oh, really? We killed one in outright. Damn. Nine and eighteen, okay. And let's get you to back away. You've seen worse. She, yeah, she couldn't have even shielded that. 
That's fine. Borak. Also, Ice Storm, pretty good spell, actually. I think I was mixing up with Sleet Storm, which is less fancy. Ooh, 23 damage. And again. Level 20 damage. Okay. Thug. He got slowed, so he can't do anything. Gotta love it. Death Ward, Guardian of Faith. I don't know if you need to go that extreme. That Ice Storm is doing us very well, though. Nope, that's not the right button. It's been a week. Level 2. 22 damage. Very nice. Well, you, you hit Thorak of all people. They're all hitting for Thorak, who has a million AC. Oh, you actually managed to push him down. And then... <laughs> okay, I love it. Stab him in the butt. Well oh. struck. 20 damage. <clears throat> and one. But what can you do? That's why getting a fighting style is very fun for certain rogues. That dual wielding. Okay. You did your big one. Now let's not go too extreme. Hmm... Try and take out the little guys. Nope. It's close enough though. Up you get. Just clean up. Kill him. Kill him. That was mine. And then Tanya. I mean, there's no real reason to do anything extreme. Let's see if you can't catch him with a flame. Oh yeah, there's one over there, that's right. Still can't hit. Gotta love it. Paladins. Ooh. He's a paladin with tough. He's not dying. Wow, okay. Don't lose hope. Good job. Okay. Just make it easy on us. Couldn't even kill him. It was a bit much, I suppose. Actually, it was asking a bit much. That is very true. How much health? Yeah. Oh, wow. And, of course, the natural 20 is on him. He is very dead. That is so overkilled. You know what? Move up and use your new strength to bop him. Look at that. And run. Just run at him. Or her, rather. Ominously. Still trying to hit Thorak, of all people. I'd say go over here. I mean, you might as well shoot. You're not going to get sneak attack, but... You know. Ten, I don't know what that's from. Maybe, oh, from his bows. His bow, I think, maybe. Yeah, the Magnificent, or the Remarkable Arrow, and... Actually, it's not. It's only a basic longbow. Huh. I'd say... Can't trip her. Come on, you can do better. Missed and still did five. I love that feat. Thorak can do nothing but run. Well, I suppose actually we could... Throw a couple javelin. Miss. Again, so you can only th no, okay. Eleven damage, pretty good. Finish her, please. 
Bomb. Yep, now we have to search. Okay. Well, that's... That was interesting. Get his javelins back, the coins. More coins. Actually, you might as well take all the weapons, right? Scroll of Mage Armor, I'll take the Dispel Magic and give that to her. She already has it, though. I think. No, she doesn't. She could add it to her book with that. Very good. Secret Wall. We'll deal with that later. There's a handwritten note. Oh, okay. What have you found? Enough to implicate Roderick and his friends. They were smuggling goods in and out of the temple quarter. Hmm. Yep, that's pretty much what it says. Hmm, a prime short sword. Food. Gold. Engraved bone dice. Okay. A bean. It's actually a venom gland, but it looks like a bean. And let's grab the loot from the actual corpses. Prime Scimitar, and take all these equipment, the scroll kit, and all the miscellaneous weaponry and armor, we'll take. And there's a secret wall. With a chest. Hello. Copper, and amethyst. Crafting for basic poisoned arrows. We already know that. And a Warhammer plus one. We already have one of those, I think. Yeah, we could dual wield it, as funny as that would be. No, wrong. That'd be funny, though. I don't actually know if we can dual wield them, because it's not a light weapon. We need a feat for that. Okay. Well, that's, uh, all that's down there. Let's go back to the guard, and then we can go and stash slash sell some of these. I think if we get a primed Warhammer, we can make a fun enchanted Warhammer, but for now, we have just the plus one. <sighs> Damn. Don't know why I'm so tired. It's annoying. Now, of curiosity, you. Yes, but I don't even actually know if we have a hammer. Great arch of sha great axe of sharpness. Empress Garb Chain Shirt. Huh. It gives you... It's a, oh, it's a chain shirt of plus two. That's pretty good, actually. Chain Mail of Robustness. That, that's essentially full plate. Okay. Great sword. None of us use great swords. I almost wish we had made a dual wielding paladin. Because that would have been pretty funny. Warden bleed. You know, we could always switch to a long sword if we get an awesome long sword. It does the same damage as a warhammer. It's a D8, D10, isn't it? I think so. Scimitar of acuteness. It's the same as his long sword. This, however, 
It does... I don't know what that damage type is. That acid? Huh. That could be something, though. I mean, he has a... Just a plus... That's Windows Key. He has plus one short sword. Could make him an acid short sword. And it's a plus one as well, isn't it? Yeah, it's a, it's a 1d6 plus 1 plus 1d6 acid. Yeah, it, it says it in the properties. I didn't even see that acid damage. White burn created by the first Dantar to fight a troll invasion coming from the swamps to the south of his domain between the Seal Toffin and the Scarafin. Hmm. We might look into that. DC 15 takes 18 successes. But... Tempting. Very tempting. I'm inclined to do that, actually. Also, let's look at this. Yes, it's a D8. So if we find an awesome longsword. Something like this. Which gives you plus one to your AC. You can cast Spirit Guardians. It's not like he's going to have many other concentration spells, so. So either that or a Frostburn Longsword, which does a D8 cold. Huh. Okay, we'll look into that. I don't actually think we have a primed anything, though, do we? Primed Dagger... We can maybe we might be able to buy one though. I'm gonna sell one of these because we don't need that many. Okay, what to store? Anything fun? We have so much food. We'll store the. Well, actually, we might as well sell it, right? Just give him everything that we're selling. We'll keep the sword on us. Sell the orb. Yeah. You, you're good on everything. Magnificent dagger. Oh yeah, sorry. You have a magnificent dagger. It's a plus two. We're gonna do that. We're gonna take a look at that with identify and get it right. Plus, just because it, it looks nicer. But yeah, we'll definitely identify that. Let's just... Oops. Do that real quick. Because you have to identify it before you can use it properly. It's a plus... Two dagger. Yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. And now we can just sell a bunch of this random stuff. And... I wonder who has... We'll have to look around. Someone, if they have a... Primed longsword. We'll have to look for it. Deputies. Also, maybe like a, a magic we longbow. We do require your services. They do, but we need to be a higher rank. Okay. Yeah, they have scrolls as well, don't they? Yeah. Well, let's sell these. Yeah, we can sell that. We don't need. It. 506, look at that. We're good on this. Yep. Mm, just because I want to look around before I forget, I'm going to see if anyone will sell us primed things. We don't have nearly enough with her to do it, but 
We might. You never know. Deputies, how are you today? We do require your services. So there's items. Anything. Oh, these are all scroll creation, aren't they? Yeah. Scroll of Wall of Fire, though. That'd be fun. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's. I'm just checking in with everybody. Checking with the Arcanium Man. Headland Shore Spell. Okay. Clear skies, adventurers. Because if we can buy the we materials, your services. it's usually better to make or find magic items than to, uh... Okay, yes, they have primed materials. Primed... Long sword. Great beer. Really? Dagger, great sword, battle axe, mace, great axe, long bow. Rapier, short bow, morning star, scimitar, short sword. No long sword. There it is, prime long sword, okay. We need brotherhood. Okay. That's something to work towards then. That's something to work towards, because we can get primed longbow as well for whenever we get I don't even think we can make magic longbows, but when we can. Okay. Well, that being that. Yes, yeah, so we have to report back to this man. And then probably take a proper long rest. Because we do need it. Hey, Stig. I heard what happened. Roderick's a shadow caster? Roderick's a corpse. He attacked us with a bunch of his friends. Take this. You could follow up and shut down his network. Oh, fantastic. Thanks for the help, my friends. Stay in the light, Stig. Okay. That went well. Justice is blind. Beat the... Oh. Complete the Lawkeeper background quest. Oh, I see. That's the quest because that, that is my background. That's her background. Aristocrat. Aristocrat, rather. So that might be what her thing is. Hers, I think, is the quest around with the holy symbol. And uh, Spy, which is... You know, why would having the quest about being in trouble here? That's interesting. They made it not per character, but per background. You know, I wonder... This might... This... I'll just go back here, because it's annoying. Might do a... Eventually, we can do a second game of this at some point. Maybe once they have the Sorcerer DLC. That'd be interesting. Who goes there? I'd like to see Ambassador Crawley. Cancel Crawley. business. Crawley. Hmm. Follow me. Um, Just like that? Shut up and follow. Gave her either a bribe or some fancy little item. Another half damned. Senior deputy of the Legacy Council. Nice to see you too. Can't say I expected your visit. I bumped into Belmont at the palace residence. And? He seems to suspect me over the stolen treaty plans. Seems to? He's pretty eager to pin it on me. I can't let that happen. That's why I'm here. Them? It's a very fancy study, right. by the way. Trustworthy. Wanky. You have to take him out. 
I can't suggest a course of action. You just need to plant something in the New Empire's embassy. Oh, is that all? Unless you have friends in the Silent Whisper. I might. Once it's in the right hands, this will kill our friend Belmont's credibility. It looks like you have this all figured out. I always plan for every contingency. We should go. Well, then this time, it's farewell for good. Okay. That was just a quick little cutscene. Bum, bum, ba -dum. Um, but yeah, I will probably do a second run of this either on my own or on stream, depending on the time and when we do it. I do know once this is done, we'll probably do another similar game. You like really Pathfinder, want to break maybe. into the new Empire's embassy? This is crazy. Sure. Okay, that was that. That was all that cutscene was. Okay. I'm actually going to go see them if they have anything to buy. Now that we have money. The Antiquarians are best Clear friends skies, with us. My friends. We have helped them a lot. We do require your services. Now we just need to work on the other ones. Yes, we're Brotherhood. We need Living Legend and a lot more money for that. But the Boots of Levitation were... We could get, if we had more money, that is something to keep our eyes on. Hmm. Could we get a random, like, Cloak of Protection, for instance? Parry up of health, me. Now, the Stone of Good Luck does intrigue me. She has two. I have two. I might save. I think I'm going to save the money, to be honest. Yeah. I think I'll save it. I would love to get something fancy like that, but... We have a better chance of finding it, I think. That's usually the way it goes in D&D. &D. Shadow of the Past. Find the secret entrance. Oh. Probably not by the front door. But take a guess there. Might be down there, though. If I had to guess, it would be down there somewhere. Maybe? I don't know. Does Priest have anything to say? Just while we're up here. Sun on your face, travelers. Balance and harmony, chaplain. Fair weather, faithful one. Howdy. We have, do require your services. Do you have anything good? Was it just the basics? Just a lot of the basics. Reverify scroll that you can buy, which is pretty cool. Uh. We have a few scrolls and such. I want to work on getting dispel magic in her book. I think. Just be the one out of my inventory. Hmm. Incriminating dossier. Dossier? Dossier. I don't know. Dozier. Down there somewhere. Let's see it.
there's something pinging down here. Ah. It's going to be the sewer, isn't it? Yep. In we go. That's not an embassy. Just okay. not its best side. Sewers? Inch. Really? How did you know about this? Mind your own business. This way. Stay low. I mean, do you even have to ask at this point? Just assume that he's doing a lot of shady shit. He is a rogue with the spy background. <laughs> Now, we are going to have to be stealthy, which means, yeah. We're going to have to have him be the stealthy one. Because everyone else is hopeless. I don't know what this is, but I want to grab it. Give me. Stuff. Lots of stuff. Run. Run, run, run. That was a lot of stuff, actually. Deep pain. Stormblade longsword. Superior healing potion. Wow. Also... Dark Stab. Aravad's Kissed Poisoned Arrow. And we already have Tiger Fang. Here. Okay. Yeah, that was good. So far, so good. I will save it now, I think. Gonna be just him by himself. Whole time. Actually, that being said, we could have two people. Ooh, you know what might be worth it? Invisibility. We do have a potion of invisibility. Which... Sure. Yourself. Just in time, I think. Opening stuff like this doesn't break invisibility, does it? No. Okay, good. Because we are robbing this place. Yep, that's great and all. What else can we do, though? Can we get anything else? Wait, right here. What's down here? Okay, I will save over this one. We've completed our test. We can go. I want to explore further. Now, in theory... Nope, nope, nope. I'm invisible, so it should be fine, right? Oh, oh, never mind. Well, good thing we checked. It's still good to use that potion because, I mean, what we're going to do with it otherwise. It'll just help us get out quicker. And we can investigate the entire place. Because they know there's something, but they can't see me. So it's easy to stealth around. Perfect. Emerald. Big ol' amethyst. Give that to him to sell. Give that to her. Antitoxin will keep on you. Cool. Now this. I think I'm going to make one of those. Thank you. Takes 
We're going to save the magnesium, actually. Yeah. You... 1d8. 1d6. Nah. We're fine. We're fine. Okay, everybody. Out. And then we will go actually rest. Well, actually, we're going to go copy the spell into the book and then we'll rest. But yeah, I don't know how many streams there are of this. I mean, we're... Mm, 25 hours? Then again, I'd wager five of those hours were just... Wasting time and fights, or endlessly going back and forth between inventories, because I do that. So 20 hours. There's still another 20, 30 hours left, I imagine, especially with how I play. So we have at least four to six weeks left, maybe. So let's, let's wager two months. What is that? July, August? Whenever it's done, we'll start another one of these. Maybe Pathfinder Kingmaker. I don't think Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous will be... Is it being released or is it going to be in beta? Open beta, I don't actually know. Either way, we'll play something. Maybe like Pillars of Eternity. Or Baldur's Gate. I don't know. When is that coming out? Also, I don't know if my computer could handle Baldur's Gate, actually. It has difficulty with this sometimes. Okay, prepare spells. Oh, that's right. I wanted to. I'll do it. I'll do it next time. I will do it next time. We'll keep Ice Storm. That was fun. Yes, these are all useful. Yes. You? Doesn't really matter, does it? If he had a hand open, he could use shield as well, which is fun, but... Get him 27 AC. We'll keep banishment. It's probably good. Yeah. Yeah. Out of curiosity... No, it said she had plus one, but I don't know what that is. Oh, plus one to her strength, that's right. We can get a magic one of those if you wanted to. But a sort. Yeah, once she's done that potion, I think we might start doing that. Actually, might as well do before I forget. Scribe. Three hours. And not that much gold. Cool. So now she has Dispel Magic, which is a ritual? No, it's not a ritual. We should get her more rituals in her book. That'd be fun. They're basically free spells. Because identify, you know, we're not going to, uh... Not going to cast identify for real. Usually, we're not that pressed for time. And we also have a couple scrolls if we were pressed. That's the beauty of scrolls. Is Lord Belmont around? Yeah, he had to return home. In oh. a rush? Indeed. Thank you, Ravensworth. You're welcome, deputies. Well, that fixes that. 500 XP. And an achievement. I spy with my little eye. Huh. That's the spy background. We might knock out all the background quests we have, actually. He can craft, too. Ooh. He has plus four. He uses his... 
wisdom. Yeah, it's wisdom for medicine. Okay. Anything else left in the city? I'm all over the place. Let's do her quest. Yes. But first, let's sell to her the two or three things we have to sell. Dump the extra thing. And we'll probably, we can keep the primed dagger actually, because those are probably useful and we might use them. A primed great axe, on the other hand. We do require your services. So I'm, I'm, that's why I was fine with selling that one earlier. Sell the thing, we already have it. We have all these strength potions that we should really use. And... Hmm... We might as well keep... One. I don't actually know if... We'll have to see if she can use this. It might have to be on our hot bar. I don't know. Um... Yeah, that's good. She got a lot of stuff. We can't get a longbow plus one. Unfortunately... Any spells... We'll grab Entangle, because she can put that in her book. I'll, I'll just grab a few. Uh, I don't think she has Shatter, either. No, she does. She has Shatter. Hideous, Identify, Jump. So no Thunder Wave, Blindness, or Entangle, correct? Mm, no. Okay. I'm alright with that. That's fun. Well, basically, I don't know how many spells she has, but we're filling it. We're filling the book up. I think, can you get... We could probably get a second spell book, too, if we had to. But, considering that this is only going to level 10, and only 5th level spells, I think we're fine. If we fill up a hundred pages with first to fifth level spells, um, don't really care about that one right now. No. Yeah, if we fill up that book with first to fifth level, I'll be impressed. That's an accomplishment in and of itself. I bet there's an achievement for it. Was I going to put anything in here? I can, but actually, we'll we'll put the short bow in here. Hmm, flaming, corrosive, etc. Might as well. He is working through his remarkable arrows. Look, look how big the bow is. That's as big as he is. Look at that. Maybe taller. I love it. It's ridiculous. Bag lady. Any new ones? No. Mm. Very well. Let us leave. Let's head to this estate to wrap that up. It's not very far. Tannison Estate. Yeah, it takes a day. They're resting, okay. Cool. So can I go? I can. I can go in here and they can directly. I... I think I'll have her do it. Make one more superior healing, and you. Oh, I really like the look of 
white burn. That would be a very nice short sword for him. Blood of Sawasta. I don't know how rare that is. That. I'm just curious. Because, you know, if there's only, you know, X amount in the game. Um... That's yeah, fine. I don't really care. Back to Streamlabs, back to Solasta. Yeah, I say we go for it. Between that... Well, actually, we can do both. The Frostburn Dagger. But it's a, it is... Oh, it's 1d8. Ooh. Let's start with his main hand. It basically gives him a d6 of acid on every hit. And then we'll go for this, because technically this is, at minimum, the same damage. Because it's 1d4 plus 1 plus 1d8. So even if it is a 1 on a 1d8, that's plus 2. That's the same as a plus 2 dagger. But it has the potential for 13 max damage. As opposed to 6 max damage on the dagger we have now. It is hard, but... Her Arcana, plus seven, plus, I think, her proficiency in the Rosary. Actually, I don't know how does, does it use both. Oh, no, it's either or. So it's a plus seven. She ro If she rolls an eight or higher, 18 times. Mm. Fuck it. Go for it. What's the worst that can happen? Yes, and the magnesium hurts us, but we don't have any. We'll have to pick some up later. Bandits. Ah, damn. Okay. A little bit of uh, target practice. Although we should actually not waste too many big things because we're probably not getting a rest. Between now and when we do it, though, there's six enemies. Okay, it's a lot of them. Can't quite hit though, can they? Second miss. Hmm, is just charging. Oh, he just managed to get a hit in. And third arrow miss. Gotta love it. Now this, this looks like a caster. Right. Well. Hmm. We could go tried and true. Spirit Guardians. And move up a bit. Ah, see, it's Spirit Guardians on this particular map that it doesn't like, does it? We'll have to make it quick, then. Yeah. Sorry about that frame rate. That's, uh... Nothing I can do. Those are good damages, too, by the way. It's damn good. Yeah... Yeah. Oh. Yep. Yes, I know it's minor issues. It's this, for whatever reason, this map it doesn't like. Okay, now they can hit. Now let's just see... Attack of Opportunity, yes please. 
Miss. Try again. Oh, because he still has a javelin yeah. out. What? Sneak attack on the attack of opportunity. You gotta love it. Rude. First of all, switch back to your real weapon. Let's go kill this caster. Shield. Damn. That was very bad smite damage. Okay. Just all on him because she's shielded. Not gonna make that mistake. And she probably should have shot from grass, but that's fine. Mm, yeah, I'll power it. I don't know what level magic missile it was, but. Wow. Burned through all their spells, though, so. That's something. First things first. Let's move so they're within my spirit guardians again. And then. Guiding bolt, why not? That went way wild. Okay. Let's go for the big guy. Another victory. Perfect. And you Oh. Natural 20, but it wasn't on a good wasn't very good damage though, so. Yeah, hopefully we can end this quickly so we can get our frame rate back. I apologize about that. I will do my best. Yeah. Once more, we prevail. Probably didn't need to use the smite, but whatever. They're perfectly bunched up. I think you know what that means. Goodbye. That one didn't even fight back. Two dead, one succeed. Gotta love it. Damn. Yeah. To be expected. Switch and shoot. Blow. Arrow right to the chest. She did. They're not bandits. Uh no. Oh. More like hired assassins. You know what this means. Stay alert. The notary's mansion might not be safe either. Ah. Lovely. Well then. Maybe we should at least short rest. Yeah, I'm just gonna take it all and give it to him. There's a lot of good stuff there, though. And all magnificent gloves. Hello. Okay. What do we got? Crafting materials go to her. Yeah, just swap up that. Long sword, heavy crossbow, chain mail, short sword. Oil goes to her. She can have the scroll of scorching ray. Acid goes to her. Dagger will keep because we're going to sell all this. Emerald to her. Magnificent gloves we're looking at. And scroll of fireball. And... I guess some of this heavier stuff we can ditch and give to her. Because she, she has a haversack. Words failed me temporarily. Okay, so you, ritual, identify these gloves. What are they? I have an idea, but that was not what I thought they were, but I'll take it. Gloves of missile snaring. You can use your reaction to reduce the damage of an oncom uh, incoming missile. Huh. Now, the thing is, there's only two people with a hand open. I'll give it to her. She can wear it, right? Yeah. We'll have to unattune from something, though. 
Uh, bring us protection. Maybe in, actually instead. Eventually we can maybe give it to him, but at the same time, no. Let's actually then give them to him. Just so somebody can have it, because... Plus 2 AC and plus 1 AC, that makes her have 16 AC. She can have 19 if we use Mage Armor. It's amazing. And this Amulet of Health gives her 14 extra health. So we're not giving any of this up. If we had to, we could get rid of the Bracers of Defense. She gets 1 AC, 1 Saving Throw, and Dispel Magic. But Bracers of Defense are very useful, and I don't want to give them up. Uh, maybe not a long rest, but definitely a short rest. Roll, roll a couple. Arcane recovery. A first and a third, perfect. And attune you to... Gloves of Missile Snaring. And I don't think there's any limit, there's no charges or anything, so... Cool. It's just a reaction. And I wonder how much it is, actually. He has uncanny dodge, so. We'll have to see. If they're not going to be useful, then we can just sell them, but they're probably pretty useful. Maybe just not on him. Maybe we can swap the Ring of Protection out. Into the estate we go, okay. Heritage of Distrust, Heritage of Anger. Huh. They're all here, along with the notary. Huh. Let's save. Let's go over. I really probably should keep some of the older ones, but I only do them because... I just want to make sure that I have multiple on each stream. I don't actually care about keeping old ones. Probably should, but... So, you just, like, left Kirkithlin without a word. How rude. I hate both of them. Can we take this inside? Just tell us what you decided and stop wasting our time. At least share the inheritance. I need it for my research. The Circle of Danantar will reward you. Yeah, right. That inheritance will give me enough to get married. My father-in-law-to-be is very influential in the Tower of Knowledge, you know. I hate both of Adrian? them so much. I respect Mother's decision. It's all yours. What? Did the Sorax replace you or something? Uh, even for you, Drew, that's low. Ah, so you're all here. Why didn't you come in? You're right. Let's finish this. Um. Now. And maybe we should split it. Four ways. <clears throat> the problem is, I don't know how much it is. That's the thing. If it's a ton of coin, then I'm inclined to at least take a little bit. We're definitely sharing it. But I just want to I'm just want to see how much it is. Huh. 
I don't know. It doesn't say how much it is, and I'm not looking too far because I don't want to spoil it. I'll try to split we'll it. split the inheritance between the four of us. Oh, I'm sorry. The law forbids it. Oh, of course it does. You can share it after you accept it, but there must of course be it does. one single heir. You know, paperwork. Okay. Um... This is the question. Audrey is nice. I hate the other two, but Tower of Knowledge definitely could use them to uh, help us out. I think they're the ones that have the primed weapons we want. Yeah. I'm sure it'll go badly, but I mean, we saved before. If it turns out this all goes to hell, I almost want that faction. I'll Ugh. give Drew the inheritance. Executive yes. decision. What? Why? Well, that's settled then. I will magically seal the will. Fine. I thought I'd cracked you. What? What? Sorry, sir. This will have to be done outside the law, I'm afraid. Um... Oh, okay. Okay. So she was Sorak. Okay. What the fuck? Fine, glad I didn't give it to you then. Screw you. She did just kill. Oh, damn. Stay with us. 26 damage. That hurts. See, I thought I was just going to, you know, give it to one of them because I wanted the faction. But no, it turns out. I guess it's a good thing we didn't give it to her. You. Move up. You're, you are perfect for this. Divinity, Scourge of the Hidden. And. Hmm. No, we'll just end it for you. Anton. Shoot him. Ooh. 31 damage. Wow. And run. Run away. End turn. You. Uh... Honestly? Just let Thorat go wild. And also run away. Shield if you have to. Hey, didn't even hit him. Or her. Didn't even hit her. Just split. You, on the other hand... Let's try this. Let's try a Guardian of Faith. Which should protect. Oh, did it get... It counterspelled? Which we couldn't counterspell the counterspell because... Oh no, we, she failed. Oh. Perfect. Sweet. Fear. Yeah. I don't want her casting. Attack. Hit and kill, please. Damn. Natural one. You going for the rogue, man. Hey, it didn't even hit him anyway. Okay, never mind, you did. Yeah. Uncanny dodge. Hey, that was mine. Oh damn. He took twenty from the guardian and is now dead. Does she count as I don't know, we're just gonna hit her. Of course. Better luck next time. Hmm. One last. Damn it. <laughs> okay. You know, I don't really why you really don't want to be here. So let's disengage and move over here. And then shoot her. 
shoot her. Sure. Nope. Didn't didn't work. Okay then. Well, only first and firsts and seconds left. Let's just try and hit him with acid arrow, shall we? Cool. That works. Now. Hmm. Let's. Tr I guess let's try a blindness. Yeah. Let's try. Phone went off. It's a bill thing. He succeeded though. That's fine. Her turn. That wasn't that bad. Please hit her. Nope. Her and shield. She loves shield. Look at her. She's climbing in the bushes. What's she doing? Okay. So far. Okay. Perfect. Two misses. Mm, I think it's actually better with your speed. Chase her down. There we go. Natural 20. Of course we're going to level 2 smite. Jeez. Yeah. How much was that? 30, 40, 7, 51 points of damage. Yep, that's uh, that's a paladin, all right. That was only one of our attacks, but unfortunately, we we just don't we don't have the movement to go back to him. So, damn, well, that's good. We basically just one shot her. Come on, come on, man. I mean, I guess it is much bigger and scarier. I guess it makes sense that you don't want to hit it. Now. We don't have many spells left. Mm hmm. Yeah. It's really. We could use a scroll spell, but I don't think he's that big of a threat. Realistically. Her, though. Anything good for your scroll? No, we actually did sell off a scroll of. Uh. Inflict wounds. So maybe we shouldn't have done oh, that. Bad luck. Probably should have used a cantrip as well. Whatever. No big deal. Yeah. I mean, might as well, right? Okay. 16. His AC is 17, probably. I don't actually know. Let's go, though. I think level one will do. Yeah. Technically, we didn't even need it. Well, they're all dead. She killed all her siblings? Maybe she was a Sorak agent. They were all my childhood friends. Oh, yes. Sorry. Well, it's over. Rip. Let's go. You know, sorry about your friends and all. We're definitely looting the house, though. Definitely. Let's take it all to Thorak and then divvy it out. It's only a little bit. Little bits and pieces. Poison and arrows to the rogue. Including the remarkable arrow. I don't know. You know what? Put both of these useless crossbow bolts so you stop picking ammo up. You have no use for ammo. Your ammo is a javelin at most. Oh yeah, Garden of Faith can't move, that's fair. And he was hasted, so lethargic, that's right. That went pretty well, though. It's a good thing that we are the paladin we are, because Sorak are pretty much our favorite enemy. It's a fancy house. Very nice. wonder if there's probably no use in looking for secrets. We'll probably find it anyway. Oh, there's a uh, bookshelf. Secret door. 
Hello there. Wait. I'm seeing a trap. Well, good thing we have a rogue. 16 plus 11. Love it. Well, wow. uh, that's a lot of gold. I'll take the stuff and then take all the gold at once and count up how much we got. Magnificent scale armor. Right, we're at just under a thousand. Huh. That's what, about 330 gold? Okay. That's, you know, it's not stellar, but... It'll do, I guess. Right, you. Yeah. We already know this recipe, so we'll give it to him so we can sell it. We already know that one. And that one. Now this. Primed rapier. Journal. We'll give that to Thorak for now. We'll identify it shortly and you know was that all can't go upstairs okay well then maybe we'll identify it now i'd have thought there'd be more oh well this is probably either a plus one or plus two scale if i had to guess yeah plus one scale armor not great though i don't think no, yeah, it's the 15 max of two, 16 max of two. We have plus one half plate, so we're fine. We're free to sell that. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, these dead people. Well, I guess now, I don't know. We'll start on one of these, but we'll go back to the city first. Let's do that. Just to queue something up. Might as well complete the last of the background quests. I think I actually got an achievement. Yeah, the arist aristocrat. Not aristocat, aristocrat. Background quest. That's three out of four. We have city guard, spy... Oh, what the hell? And, uh, now aristocrat. Oh, these. Wonder if we can go down there eventually. Maybe. Let's go fast just to get back there. Yeah, perfect. Mm. And then we'll look. We might want to gate to places, actually. Yeah. There are one or two chests that actually I think we can benefit from using the gate. Maybe. We'll have to see. As it is, we're just going to sell and store things for now. Which... Start here. We'll probably rest soon as well, but... In fact, we might want to rest before we gate around. What do we got? Oh, we can't even read it. It's just... A personal journal with most of its pages torn out. The re remaining ones tell a dark tale of falling under the dominion of Aravad. Aravad. Why does that sound familiar? Hmm. Anything? Yeah. Drop... The rapier. Give these over to Thorak. We already have a poisonous kit. Well, I don't know. We have one. Notebook page. What is this? Why do we have this? Oh, this is... We've had this forever. Yeah. Didn't even know we had that still. We have all these scrolls, which we intend to, to uh, scribe. I intend to copy those into our book, but who should we give this to? I guess it depends on how much it's worth. 
because we do want the antiquarians to be our friend friends. But then again, we want the Tower of Knowledge to at least kind of like us so we can get crafting materials. They have primed weapons that I really want so we can enchant good Deputy. items. How are you today? Do you namely, have some lovely loot from the Badlands? Namely a long sword and a long bow. Indeed. Let's see how much it's worth. Three relation. Yeah. Clear skies to you. It it wouldn't help anyway, but might as well work a little bit towards it. Deputies, how are you today? I'm just gonna double check. I think we these were the ones. Require your services. At some point. Uh no, they well, we still want to get them higher because they have all these. These fancy I think oh the Arcanium we want it. But we do want this because we can craft scrolls of them, because crafting scrolls works differently in this than in normal uh D D. Go to Danatar. Let's go sell to them. They like us best, I think. I don't know which shops have the best prices, but I think you get better prices for Clear having skies, my high friends. relations. We do require your services. One day. One day we'll have you. Belt of fire giant strength. I'll just I'll sell to him. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna just get rid of that. Okay, 337. Done. Let's just make sure we don't have any random little, uh... No, they didn't accidentally auto-equip a magic item. That's good. We could get a haversack. I don't think we need it. We have, If we're going to buy a item like this, we're going to just wait till we can get a bag of holding. We have a bag of holding and two haversacks. I think we're good. Oh, this ran we have so much we have so many random arrows that we just don't use we should really start using these yeah stack those as well you can craft things ooh long night what do they do a 1d4 no not really worth it at least not yet not when we have so many other ways and things to use Right. We're going... It's just quicker to go down here to do it than going through a loading... Like a loading sequence. So I'll spend 10 gold to do it. Hello, adventurers. What can I offer you? We want to rest. We'd like to stay for the night. Yeah. Because... We won't get a chance to rest if we're teleporting around. Do we have anything to attune? No. Prepare. Did I ever give her dispel magic? I think I did. Unless I'm blind. Meh. I'm sure it's somewhere. I must be missing it. Yeah. We can't go to our items, so... We're all fine on our spells. We're fine. Oh, she has... Five successes, okay. That's something. I swear we taught her to spell magic, though. Didn't we? Huh. Strange. Very strange. Well, might as well scribe these while, while we're here. Oh, maybe she failed. That might have been it. 
She might have failed to scribe it and wasted it. Okay. Is this one of your spells? No. Hmm. Okay, we'll sell it then. No one can use it. It's probably a, it's a ranger thing. Featherfall. I had one more, didn't I? Thunderwave. Yeah. Because I got these specifically to do this, so might as well do it now. Okay. She got... Yeah, she also makes the check with advantage because she's a lore master, so that's fun. Cool. Can't do this one yet because that's a level 5 spell, apparently. I think. I swear Contagion was 7 in normal D&D, but maybe it's less powerful. Not that Contagion is particularly powerful at that stage because everything has really good con most of the time. I have never seen Contagion actually work. It's amazing if it does, but it usually doesn't. Just to make sure, yeah. Cool. Everyone good? All these random potions. Just, yeah. You know, I don't actually think we need two thieves tools. I don't know if these can break. But so far, it hasn't, so... You know, I'm going to keep it on just in case. I don't want to lose them by accident. Just give all the food to him. The bag of holding with all of this food. Is it just insane? Right. Bitterroot's treasure map. This is... We can't, we can't, uh, go here with a gate. We can go to a gate to this fortress, though. Hmm. Let's briefly go as if we were leaving and decide where we want to go next. We can gate to the fortress. It's apparently a level 8 quest, though, so... Might be a bit tough for us. But let's see. We have a... There's a gate. No, there's a quest. Which one's had a gate, I wonder? This had a gate. This had a gate. This had a gate. Oh, damn. We have to go quite away for the gems, don't we? We have a quest here. Hm. I guess we just do it the old-fashioned way. Yeah. We'll save that one for last. Let's go. Let's go to the ruins. Just do it the old-fashioned way. Let's go. Nice little adventure. Halfway done crafting. Whiteburn and the superior potion. Nice calming. It's lovely music too. Just, just nice. Relaxing. In, I don't think we've taken this exact road. Hey, look, Whiteburn. Cool. That. That's a nice weapon. It is a short sword, which is it's a plus one short sword that does one d six acid damage. Definitely switching it out. We'll keep the acuteness in the back pocket. I don't think, apparently you can't dual wield. I don't know, it wouldn't let me dual wield short swords before, apparently, so. Or maybe it was a rapier and a short sword, I don't know. I kind of like the dagger, though. 
What's up with that dagger? Look at, look at that curve. Okay. Do we have... Uh, no, we do not. Should have brought the primed dagger with us. Okay. We'll... I don't know what the fuck that sound was. We'll remember that next time. Okay. Yeah. Resume. And resume. That's all the crafting we had set up, so... It's good. It's good, it's good. Let's hopefully get to the ruins. No problem. Perfect. We were not waylaid. Oh yeah, this is a very pretty map, a very fun map. Also killed my frames. OBS did not like the water. So hopefully we can avoid the water. I think we have to go to the monastery down there, so... Cleansing. Go to the cemetery near the mausoleum. Oh yeah, so we have to actually go... Yeah, it does not like the water. Oh, damn. Let's do this and hope we can get down there. There are... Many creatures, zombies, Badlands Wraith. Oh, let's back up for a second. This is why we brought some of these scrolls, didn't we? Yes. Mage armor on yourself. You... Uh, Switch to this so you can actually cast. Aid. No, we'll do it with the basic. Thorak, anything? Probably not, right? Shield of Faith? It's concentration. Ah. To yourself. Hmm. That's fun. That is very fun. Is there a way to change... Yeah, the formation. So that way... Perfect. That way our wizard is not always in the front. I think maybe we can go from here. What do you think a well-placed fireball would do? No, it does not... I don't think they're technically enemies yet. Did we forget to close the door on our last visit? Never opened it. Well, someone's dropped by. Let's cleanse those tombs with holy water. Not many remains left for the prayer. You had to say it. Get ready, people. We're not going to try talking to them first? No harm in trying, I guess. May the light of the gods free your souls. What? Okay. <laughs> no, they're not going for it. Don't pray for me if I die. They're just chilling. It's going to be a fight. That's a lot of initiatives. Oh, Lord. Yeah, definitely shield off of that. I don't want to get hit by this thing. Luckily, it's the middle of the day. So... I think we should... Yeah, if we put this about here... Yeah. Guardian of Faith will uh, at least snag the zombies when they approach. Ten. Disadvantage. Nope, they just have standard attack. Twenty. Also, ow. Wait. No? Hello? Come on. He likes to do this sometimes. Hold it. Ow. 
Critical hit. Only did eight, though. That's pretty good. Come on. You got this game. They apparently fixed most instances of that, but not all, it seems. I guess. I mean, I was going to try a fireball. I still could, technically. Is it really worth it? Yeah. Get rid of four of them, potentially. Nobody has your skills. Bravo. Yeah. Thank, thank God for fireball. Damn. Gotta love it. Spectral Avenger. Ah! Oh yeah, these things. These things were bad. Yeah. Just hit. We'll go. Oh, you still have your javelin out. Well struck. Damn it. <laughs> but it still worked out. Use your fancy new sword. Or miss. That works too. Okay, real productive turn there, rogue. Wraith. That disadvantage, because he's in the sunlight, working very well for us. I guess really just... Just... Nice and simple, right? Mm, just bless people. Don't even do anything fancy, just first level bless. That's kind of what you got going on. Now this thing is right in our face. So it's either between Magic Missile, a... Ooh. Yeah. Let's stack everything on the Paladin and let him just go to town. First thing... Let's hit the Avenger. They're very dangerous. You can't win. 26 damage. Yell. Yeah, and now for your third attack because you're hasted. Yeah, you missed. It's fine. You have plus 2 AC though from that. Or you should at least. Yeah, plus 2 AC. I just realized... He, no, he does get disadvantage. We also have protection from evil and good. So even if he wasn't in the sun, still couldn't hit us. Oh. Take that. Damn, that was a lot of damage. Gotta love sneak attack, natural 20. Yeah. These poor undead had no idea what happened. Guess that's what preparation does. Just try, yeah, just try cantrip. Just... Fortune is fickle. Yeah, he resists. Uh, don't smite because you have three attacks. Yeah, see? Perfect. We are probably... We're decently close to a level up as well. Magnesium, that is actually perfect. We desperately need that. It's a very useful crafting material. Darts? No, we're just probably going to sell those. Mm, grab the remains of these. More darts. Meh. What's over here? Did we ever touch this? Orchid. Pretty. Manicallan Orchid. This is messing me up. I'm putting them back. The formation is weird, but... Yeah, I... I don't like... Having, uh... I like having her on two, because that's what I'm used to. Blessed is gone. He's lethargic, because... You know, haste. So he's stunned for a round, but... Cleanse one. Blend. 
that's two. I believe that was the one we need. That was the guy. Perfect. Who are you to disturb our eternal rest? A follower of the gods, hoping to save your soul. There are no gods in this place, fool. Do you truly believe that? Of course. Otherwise, they would have answered us in our hour of need. Did they not? I prayed and never got answered. Yes, it did. Liar! Did you not have water and the means to grow food? Barely. Were monsters not kept at bay from your valley? We heard them roam at night. Weren't you spared the worst of the mana collapse? What? And yet you survived how many years here? But my prayers weren't answered. Yes, they were. You were just too mad with grief to see it. Behold the power of a rune apostate. This is a weird camera angle. Wow, natural 20 persuasion. Uh, the Lord is still here. Thank you. It is time for you to enjoy your final rest, Emtan Darwas, Acolyte of Arun. No, good thing we got that. We'd have to fight probably a supercharged Posti. Pos. No. Avenger. That's the word. So how much? 1,687 until level 8. That's a big level for us. Okay, that one's done. Mm. Let's go this one as well. Just getting done these little side quests while we're out. Nope, up here. Avoid the water. It's very pretty, but... Large bodies of water, it does not like. Okay. Well, now that we actually have magnesium, we can craft a couple things again if we want. At least potions. Hmm. Honestly, we actually have more than enough potions. We don't need more. Abyss Moss, we don't have any. Or we don't have enough, rather. No, we're fine. Menacalan Ruin will take us five days. We might as well go here first. Check in with uh, the shop keep there. I mean, say she's that's not a shop, it's just a guy. We might as well. Care Lem Outpost. First place we ever went. Hmm. I'm just going to hide. I don't. I don't really want to get into a random fight if I don't have to in the middle of the road. We're trying to do quests and things. Nice and calm. Nice and easy travel. I doubt they'll ever fix this place up. It'd be cool if eventually all these places were fixed up, but probably not. So, I mean, this outpost could easily be patched up. We might as well... Oh, here we are. Let's start with the inner fort. Look at the scavenger's board. Bertram. No, just go to the board. They should have... Yes, both of these were completed. Which means... I'm taking the magnesium... The arrow. Magnesium... No, all these arrows I don't care about. Cool. So, four more magnesium. That's very nice. 
and that. Now, to talk to Mogo. Mogo the poor. My name, Mogo the poor. Whoa, okay. Oh yeah, the spider climb thing. He just ran in along the wall. That's a sh that's show off right there. Potion of flying or a scroll of fly. We probably don't need it, but that would be fun. Hmm. Yeah, we do end up paying more than we sell. It's actually more dart. Yeah. Simple. Include. Nope. Inventory is what I wanted. Give these materials to her. Now you. Actually, we are a little low on the food. So actually, I'm going to mess with her spells the next time we take a rest on the road. So we can get great food and water. That's a big help. And a Kalon Ruin. Takes two days, one rest. Yeah. Let's do that. Hopefully it will let me validate the spells and such. Just to save us a little bit of... Yes. Prepare... We actually have a once per day of this anyway, so I'm I'm comfortable doing that. Still don't know. Oh, yeah, I still think she must have failed, which is annoying. I'm going to get Dimension Door because it's actually super useful. Resume. Okay. Yeah, we have to go deep, deep, deep into this place. But luckily, fast travel menu. It's very fun. It's actually probably my favorite of all the fast travel little mechanics, I guess you could say. Because just map. Here's a map of the area. And you can go over to where you want. And let me actually see what we're doing. Do that. The library. Yes, we go to where we want, which this time's the library. And they zoom to it. Very handy. Very handy. Now, thing is, this library is huge. I do know what I actually want to try. Can we finally get this damn thing over here? This chest. Will Spider Climb let us go over there? No. Maybe we can shoot it down? I would really love to at long last. Look at this. Let him go. Look at this man. You can't go. No. Okay. I don't know if I ever tried this, though. Nope. No, we cannot. We do not. Oh, 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 oh. Is it a waste? Probably. Do I care? No. We at long, long last. Get this damn chest. Probably not even worth it. I don't even know what's in here. Oh, look. Another what, soul gem. That's pretty good. And gauntlets that look like gauntlets of strength. That would be our third pair. We can sell it though, they're probably they're worth quite a bit. 
Ah. Let's actually do that. Ritual. Uh, yeah. Oh. We already knew it because we, we've done it before. Yeah, okay. Well, we have extra gauntlets. They're worth a thousand, though. We can sell them. And as funny as our wizard having 19 strength would be... No, we already have two. We have two gauntlets like that, so... Okay. Now we need to look around... For this quest... There might be something... I'm using the alt key, by the way, to look around for items. What exactly are we looking for? An amulet. The library returned the amulet. I guess we can just go and look around at all the chests. Okay. You go there. You go there. Nope. Can't. Okay, we'll just have him do it all, because he can spider climb. A fly spell would also do well. Yeah. These guys... Actually, just want to make your way over here. Because they might as well get near the entrance. Thorak can pretty reliably go around. Or they're just going to sit there and do nothing. Okay. Oh well. Nothing. Huh. Nope, that's the campsite. You know, I really don't know where this would be. It's just in the library somewhere. It's a pretty big library. That's nothing. I don't think I'm missing anything. Well, I might be. I might just be blind. But... Hmm. Maybe it's is actually deeper in. There tend to be enemies around whenever it's the quest area. I'm gonna look in here. If it's not in here, I'm probably just going to look it up real quick so I'm not wasting God knows how long looking around this place. Okay. Yep, which, what's it called? The Magister's Amulet. This is much easier than just... So I'm not wasting 10, 20 minutes looking around. Um... Okay. 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 Yep. Yeah, that's what, uh... Need to sneak, that is true, so... I'll go back and... Yeah. I forgot about the cautious mode does reveal some things. And it should be somewhere over here-ish. It says, just vaguely where the spiders attacked. Probably a good place to start. Yep. Cautious. I love how big the circles are. Because two of our people cannot sneak. They're very bad at it. Hmm. 
I do like this place. This is a cool looking place, though. Very fancy. Very, I mean, it fits magic cataclysm. Search over here. Where's this thing? Nope, up there. Over here. Here, maybe. I like they're climbing. He's just, just Escher walking around everywhere. Ah, oh, oh, oh. There you are. There's a rune. There's another rune. Oh, that's right. Yeah. One on each. It's probably going to trigger something and we're going to die. Little chest. That worked. That worked very well. Big boy. I suppose we have time to cast a spell. I know. I know. That's a big creature. Look at that. That's an air elemental. Look at that thing. Oh, there's four of them. The benefit to doing that, they're surprised. Run away. This is a very awkward place to fight them because they can fly. And we can't. Hmm. <clears throat> I guess back to your bow. I and mean, really, all you can actually do is. I feel like air elementals won't care about poison, but we will ready a thing. One up there. They are quite large. I guess maybe we'll just do a simple little little buff. Little bless. It's a very handy spell. Borak. Cannot reach them. He does not have a potion of fly anymore. Let's actually hop back here. And ready. Yes. One of them will probably approach him. Right. Another spell. I really do wish I had prepared fly. This touch? No. It's a tried and true. Just haste the paladin. Let him go to town. And then I want you to go back up here. You know, yeah, I don't know. Surprised alone doesn't mean you have advantage, so we didn't actually waste the turn. Might as well. It's not going to wait until he's in melee anyway, so. Oh yeah, Bracer's Archery. I've been wondering what that extra two damage is. Hmm. So in theory, you do have advantage because you're still hidden. So actually, we could just go all out with a fourth level guiding bolt. Please hit. Okay, 29. Imagine if that was a crit. As it is, that did a good chunk of damage. I thought we said caution. Ah. Smite. 27 damage. That is respectable. Slam, two slams. Now. You're hasted, so you might as well just... Oh, absolutely. Level two. Natural 20. I take no prisoners. 47 damage. Hell yeah. Hmm. Probably could have killed it if we had, but I got an achievement for getting a bunch of crits. 50 critical hits in a single campaign. Yeah. 
didn't even need to waste it. So good. That was that was productive. Let's move over here. Mm, no. I love paladins. They're the best. Moving down and yeah, all trying to hit the paladin. That, Courage. Ooh. You know, fair enough, they got a crit on me. That's very fair. It's about the only way they can hit. Actually, they have plus eight, they're fine. He's 24 AC, though. It's amazing. Right, so... We're not going to do that. You have Dispel Magic. You have... I mean, you really... Your, your thing really is just... Haste and then magic missile for days. We've already got an achievement for killing a bunch of them with magic missiles, so. Actually, before we do that, is there a scroll you can use that's actually more useful? Old person's useless for this. For the fall, contagion we can't even cast. Levitates. If we even if we could, that's concentration. I think. I think it's concentration. So, no, we're just going to Magic Missile. Mm. I mean, we're not going to kill any of them, so might as well just lay down damage, right? Perfect. Well, not perfect. That was actually abysmal. That was almost minimum damage. It's hard to see the exact... He's in melee. So it's actually... Yes, yeah, sneak attack. And... Nope, that's, that's about it. That's about it. Tanya. Concentration. I don't really want to waste the concentration right now. So... Are you close enough to get Thorak with a heal? That was weird. Just a simple heal. Three D eight plus. You heal an extra. I don't know. Like I think like six, maybe eight. He got hit pretty hard. Go for it. Heal them twenty eight. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Let's kill him. Mm. Yeah. Another victory. This is destiny. Let's, you know, burn them all. Let's smoke them if you got them, I think. I don't know. We also missed that, so that's not great. We did kill one, though. That's a plus. Yeah. Actually, it's only 2d8 plus 5. That's... Ow. They're really... Yeah, elementals can be scary. They're, they're tanky and they can hit pretty hard. I think earth elementals are the scariest because they're just tanky as hell and they do big damage. Then again, actually water can drown you, so maybe not. Damn, all you can do. It's funny. We probably should have made her the war wizard, but we made her lore master because it sounded fun. Oh. Time to switch. I don't actually know if you can get sneak attack off this, but... Oh, you did. Perfect. 25... 31 total damage. Cool. Right. Well, he has taken a beating. I mean... For the sake of concentration and my frames, let's not do Spirit Guardians yet. It does really kill things. 
I mean, we might as well go all out. You can't win. This is, uh... Let's burn it all. Let's go. Almost killed it with three attacks with three smites. It's not like we can cast with it. We don't have war caster. And... Ow. 20. That hurt. Did I get it? That's another crit. Hold it. Hammer's walking out. That was 47 damage, though. That's pretty good. You know, I'll give it to them. Give them that. It's pretty good. I mean, I would love to do something different, but... Fucking magic missile. It's, you just can't go wrong with it. Ooh. 23... Offhand with a natural 20 with a deck. That thing glitched the hell out. That was scary. Damn. Uh, yeah, just Sacred Flame it. Uh, it's to be expected. But... Thorak is the real... Run while you can! Goodbye. 1800. Oh, we hit a level. We did, we did. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Ooh, magnesium. Look at it all. Perfect. That is exactly what we need. We can make so many health potions with that. Well. That went very well. I think maybe we should return to Herr Kiflin. We also can try to track or go to this outpost as well. Yeah. He's all slow. He cannot move. So slow. Yeah, actually, real quick. No, we're not that encumbered. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see how close this outpost thing is. To get there would take six days. I mean, it's about the best we can do, isn't it? If we do that, then we can return. I mean, at that point, it might even be quicker just to go to the castle, but... Either way, I am going to uh, take a quick break. And after the break, we'll continue our travel and level up. Which is very important, level 8. At least for us. So... I'll be right back, and uh, see you soon.
Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back. Just a short little break so we can get right back into it. I am very much enjoying this game. I knew I was going to like it because I got it off or on early access. Is it or beta? Early access beta, same thing. Immediately when it released. But then I just didn't play it. But I'm glad I'm playing it now. It's very fun. It's a little weird. A little, uh... The, the cutscenes and voice acting is a little clunky sometimes, but... Overall, I'm really liking it. Let's see if, what we can craft real quick. Still can't make the mage arm. I like the mage armor scrolls best, thing. Scroll of fairy fire. Oh, we need fairy fire as well. Apparently, we don't have fairy fire. Huh. We should maybe buy that for her. I like making scrolls of mage armor, though. Very useful. Because then we don't need to waste a spell slot. Waste It uh, lasts eight hours. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, I guess make another potion with your plus seven. Might as well. Do you... If you can make a good arrow... That one's a 2d8, that's a 3d6. We don't have... You know, stop making those. We haven't even used all the ones. You know, I'm gonna switch, I'm gonna do it. Use them now. Use the big ones. Just make sure everyone has the right weapon as well. So I always forget that. Okay. Travel. Yep. Begin. And after they camp, which is right about now, we're going to level up. Yes. Resume. Perfect. Level 8. Well. Ability score. Yeah, I think definitely ability score for you. Oh, I see. It doesn't add the, uh... Because it's a 19 right now with his gauntlets. Next. Hmm. We probably should get the charisma up, to be honest. But also, 20 con. Because then also, if we get a con book, we can get him to 22 con and just have a million hit points. <clears throat> Yeah, I think we're going to do Khan. Because if we get to 20, that gives him uh, essentially 7. 7 or 8, depending if it's already calculated after this level. It's going to give him extra hit points. I think it'll be good. Because his main role is meat shield. Haste him and throw him into the action. Ton of AC, and even if he get, does get hit. Yeah, you can't actually damage him. And it's not like he casts spells anyway. So. Yeah. Well. Hmm. Yeah, important for everyone. Yeah. Then again... No, actually, no, I'm going to keep it at 18. I'm actually going to buff the con up. Yeah, we're not. Just because. I have, you know, immediately changed my mind of what I originally had planned, but I don't really care. If we get a con book, we can get him to 20. It's unfortunately, this game, I believe, only goes to level 10, so we're not getting the uh, next one. Yeah. So, let's do that. Level up you. Level 8 wizard. Now we're probably going to get... We're probably going to get the ability score. I want to see... What feats there are, though. 
No, she get a new. Yeah, let's get feet. Right. We already have for her the. What does it say? We already have the one for her that if she. Hmm. Feats for these. Interesting. Yes, we have the one for her or her that makes her so her cantrips do half damage if she misses. Pretty good, actually. I like it a lot. Hmm. You know, actually, I might actually get Master Enchanter. Half the normal time to enchant item and proficiency bonuses. Which means right now, she'd have a plus 10. Next level, she gets a, a plus 12 to enchant. Yeah. Because we can always get an int book and push her intelligence to 20. There is that option. We can buy those, actually. They're just they're very expensive. Let's go Master Enchanter. Yeah. And Powerful Cantrip. I love this feat. But that means that she has, I mean, she is going to be, she is our main enchanter, so. You can add three new spells. You know, I probably should go back. I kind of do want, nope, can't get fairy fire. No, it's not here. Weird. It is a wizard spell, I think, so. Maybe it's not, I don't know. By the way, Blur, Dark Vision, Flaming Sphere. Scene Visibility would actually be interesting. How long does that last? One hour non-concentration? Yeah, that's actually pretty good. Let's identify creatures. Hmm. Interesting. Probably not, but interesting. Stone Skin, but it does eat our diamonds. But we have plenty of them. Greater invisibility. Fire shield. Wall of fire is fun. Let's get wall of fire and let's look at the third. We could just get to spell magic now. Actually. Because. Not a ritual. I don't think any of these are really rituals. Hypnotic pattern could be fun. Yeah. Or... Now she, she has an item that lets her do it once per day, so... Maybe we don't need to get to spell magic. I actually don't mind... Hypnotic pattern. Yeah. Sure. That was fun. That was good. Let's prepare her spell. She can prepare a new spell. Let's prepare... I guess the new one. Oh, actually. Why... Yeah. Let's see how that works, I guess. She levels up as well. Level 8 Cleric. She has a Destroy Undead now. And her weapon attacks do an extra D8. That's nice. Why is her wisdom... Oh, yes. Yes. Wisdom to 20, so we can use that book. And let's get her con up so her health goes up. Up to 83. Cool. Yeah. Actually, do we have any attunement items? No, we don't. Validate. We're going to prepare, rather. Mm. 
Let's get daylight just because I kind of like it. It removes darkness. Or beacon of hope. And it's concentration. We have a lot of concentration is the problem, don't we? Yeah, let's just, let's just do that. We can actually prepare another Thorax spell. Because he has extra, extra ability. Are any of these just vocal? Because that is really the problem with us. No, we'll just get magic weapon, I guess. Doesn't really matter, does it? So, let's detect evil and good, sure. And level up the rogue. He gets ability score increase, and he actually gets another one at 10th, I believe. If it's going by the same rogue uh, thing as normal 5e. Actually, let's look at feats for him. Yeah, let's see what feats he can get. I think... I actually don't know what we got last time. So, let's see what we got. Ambidextrous. Hmm. Potentially. Armor Master, no. Dex, no. We could get his... It doesn't do... No, so there's no con. Okay. Eager for battle. Advantage on initiative is pretty good. Enduring body. Con by one, hit points increase by plus one each time you get a level. Does that also apply retroactively? Maybe. Focus sleeper. Follow up strike. No. Hard to kill? Hmm. He does do alchemy, but... I mean, not all the time. It's robust. Calm by one. Hmm. Sturdiness of the tundra. Don't really care. Take aim. Hmm. Uncanny accuracy. Let's actually go... Well, it increases... You know what I might actually do? Where is it? It's a waste of the decks, but... Advantage on initiative might be fun. Or... We just... No, I think it's I think it's better to do a feat. I think it's better to do a feat. What is this saves out of curiosity? Dex and intelligence saves. Maybe we should go Master Alchemist, just for the fun of it. Or health. Everyone does need health, don't they? Actually, maybe Twin Blade, because that'll make... Ooh. Actually, I might get... I'm going to get Take Aim. Because... That means that, essentially, we can spend our bonus action to negate the disadvantage, or using our bow, for instance, in melee. And if the person we're in melee with with our bow, or if... You know, I think we'll get that, you know. We're not going to get sneak attack unless someone's adjacent to him. But I think this means that we can just use our bow... If you have disadvantage for whatever reason, his disadvantage cancels out sneak attack. So, it'll make it a little easier to... Wait, a lock breaker, that was the other one. Yeah, let's... Yeah, do that. Why not? Sure. That all looks good. And actually, we are just below max health because of the things we did, but no, that's fine. I guess we should resume or no, before I forget, I'm just going to scribe a couple things. No, we can't. Never mind. So we shall resume. Actually, 
Can we have her read this? No. We have to do that next time we go somewhere. It would be kind of nice to uh, get that started. Yeah, I should probably change the uh, travel thing. It's fine. Because it's going to keep interrupting whenever they finish a rest, but we'll just keep hitting resume. Because I only did that to change her spell up. Maybe the last day before we get there, we'll uh, do that. Because there's still a couple more days. Orc war party. Some orcs just stopped us in the middle of the battle. In the middle of the, the travel, rather. Ready. Oh god, I hope the frames are going to be alright. Yeah, that's fine. Orc. He tried. Here's the chieftain. He's a big boy. Look how little the great axe looks in his hand. Still can't hit. Gotta love it. We still have aided. I guess do we just cast that every day? I don't know. I guess maybe we do. I don't know. Well, they're all around us, so probably can't fireball. Or can we? No. Oh. Maybe. Just drop it on us, end all of our misery. No. I, mean, I could drop it to get these three. Yeah, sure. Okay. That worked. We, uh, we killed two. That did pretty good. Sure. Chieftain doesn't care, though. He look at him. He doesn't care. I think he succeeded, so... Are you okay? Rude. Uh, no. Aid is just there forever, I guess. Weird. Very strange. Okay, you... I mean... You have calm emotions for some reason. Okay. That's funny. No, we're not going to do that. We'll keep that in mind, though. No, we're probably... Just nice, simple buff. Good old Bless. It is a really good spell, though. I do love Bless. Ooh. Very nice. 12, 18. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of damage. Yeah, let's shield. Gotta love shield as well. Let's go fight for the chieftain. Bend the knee or perish. Probably should have went for a bigger one, but it's fine. We'll do we'll do that now. Oh wow. He has to have like one health left. Which you know what that means. One, two, three, four. That one didn't even fight back. I bet if we, yeah, if we had done one level higher, it would be dead. That's fine, though. Just shoot it with a crossbow. Or miss. That works, too. Okay. 
Gonna have to do this the old fashioned way. Well struck. Well. That was easy. Don't know if we really care enough to even take. No, because we can't even sell them for that much. And they're heavy as shit. So. Where do we go? To leave? How can we leave? Get me out of here. Okay, though. That, uh... That fight went very well. Very easy. Imagine if we didn't have any magic people. Then that would be a little more complicated. Fireball does really even the playing field. I think we have one more day. Stop texting me. Stop it. Yes, now we're going to change out that because we're close to get rid of the create food for now. And pick up. Maybe instead of that. Maybe actually we can grab enhance ability. That's the Windows key. That's not alt. Yeah. Enhance ability could be fun. Oh, we can prepare more. Uh, rate of movement? Sure. Rate of movement is a fun one as well. They grant some immediate movement restrictions as well as paralyzed and restrained. If we were swimming as well, in like an aquatic area, which I don't think we will, it also removes any disadvantage from water on weapon attacks and such, as well as movement. This looks fancy. This is a quest for an NPC that they gave us a treasure map. You know, I have seen this. Was this part of the demo? I don't know. What's that? That, that little gemstone rock? Just a wall. I love it. Yeah, magnesium. Look at that. Perfect. Stalactite that can be dropped on us. Aww. Oh. Um. Quickly kill them. I don't know. It won't let me do it. Just hit him with a spell. I don't know if she'll do that, but she should. Maybe. Did we not stay silent? No. That didn't work. What is that thing? The shaman, of some sort. Okay, so her spell didn't go off, but it's fine. I'll just do it again. Keep it simple. 21 damage. I love Guiding Bolt. It's such a good spell. Nice and simple. But it's super powerful for a level 1 Ooh, spell. Must have hurt. 120 foot range. <sighs> 4d6 radiant damage advantage on the next attack. It's good. It's very good. Mm. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to move, just walk menacingly over to him. You. Uh. I guess we might as well, with the advantage, throw Acid Arrow at him. 11, okay. That's... It could be worse, I guess. Okay. But it's not a Shaman, really. It's just a... Just an Archer. 
Okay. Let's see what his dex is like. You should have yielded. It failed, and we won. Very easy. We probably could have won it with even less spells cast. But I'm not going to be picky, because obviously the less spells you cast, the longer a fight takes, and the more damage you take. Oh, damn. There's a lot of people in here. Okay. Shaman. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> Only 15 lightning, though. And of course, Anton, being a rogue, takes nothing. Evasion. Gotta love it. They did a lightning bolt on us, so that's pretty, pretty rude. I'm unbeatable. Okay. Yeah, that's what you get for being cocky. You missed your attack. Mm. I'll help out and just end the wolf. Just simple. I forgot I have the poison arrow on. Whatever. Chieftain. Hello. That's a miss. And another miss. A berserker. Still can't hit him. Just flailing. I love it. Right. So first we just have to check on what a fireball looks like. Mm. No, I don't think we can angle it to... Nope. Okay. It's always good to check. Instead... It's worked before. Haste the Paladin. Berserker. We just level one. Because it wouldn't kill it, but... It's reckless. Still can't hit. Okay, that one does. Tonya. Might as well move right up into melee with everybody. Hmm. How about this? Drop silence in the corner. So she cannot cast. That'll do. Even with advantage, it missed. Okay, I mean, she climbed out of the silence, but she had to get right up to us. I'll counter blur because it's annoying. Now, why she got in melee with me, I don't know. You can't win. She is going to regret that. Come on. Don't choke. Let's do it. Perfect. That was very dumb of her. Why do you have advantage? Oh, because it went reckless. That's right. Hmm. We should really look into getting that fancy dagger. Making the frost dagger for him. They're just trying so hard. Bless their hearts. That guy needs a literal natural 20 to hit for. <laughs> oh. It's so rude. I love it. Okay. What with that? Ooh. Hmm. Nine. How much is nine? So let's put a third to secure the kill. Or not, because... Yep. Yeah, I'll have it. 
See, part of his problem is that he's only using a mace. He's only getting a d6 out of it. So... Okay. A little silence is useless. But it got her to move towards us, so that's actually a good thing. I think... You know, lay down the Guardian of Faith in the middle, and... I don't actually... We'll see if it's movement. Yeah, actually, it's a little wasted, isn't it? Yeah, I realize that now. It's only when the creatures move in, not when they start their turn at it. That's Spirit Guardians. Yeah. Natural 20? Yeah. That's the 47 way. damage. And even then, 47 damage, he's still not going to die from three hits. Nope, just died from three hits. That was a lot of damage. Mm. Let's get the sneak attack off on him. Okay. Yeah, offhand, just stab him in the face. Oh, I love it. Paladins are rude. They're my favorite. And actually, honestly, we really don't even need to use up spells at this Not point. Bad, eh? Yeah, that spell's a little wasted, but whatever. It's fine. You have a bunch of first levels, just throw one out there. Natural one, okay. Hmm. Might as well go for the Berserker while you have a bandage on him. Yeah. And then do your other attacks there because someone else can take care of him. Or miss. Bend the knee or perish. Might as well stab him, gives you advantage. And then go stab the wolf. It's over. It's over. Palpable hit. I feel like maybe if the uh, the shaman hadn't run down into melee like an idiot, it might have gone a little differently. But luckily, she offered herself up to us. Coin, food. I'll take the pelt. Mm, no. What's that? Scroll of Charm Person. Don't need to put that, or don't need to take that. Just put it into our book now. Which is what I was hoping to do. I almost took Charm Person, to be honest. Chest up there. Silver chalice, okay. We're getting some good loot from all this. Mm, end your silence, please. Oh, fancy. We already have a shield plus one. Although, actually, it makes her so when she's in melee. She is much more offensive. Perfect. What's this? It's a bunch of... I don't know what that is. It's a crate. A slave step. We know of one thing we can make with that. The chain shirt. Even though the chain shirt's not great. I don't think we have anything else we can use the slave stone for. No. We're probably not using it on the chain shirt though, because it's not that good. And finally. Silent Whisper Cipher Disc. This ancient item was used by the intelligence service of the Manakalan Empire. 
With the right skill, a spy could use a mechanical device to encrypt or decrypt a written ma message without using magic. Okay. Okay. Cool. Well, yeah, we should probably... We might as well rest, right? Actually, no. We have to rest on the road anyway. Can't... There's no gate here, so... We'll have to see. We'll have to see if it's actually quicker to go ahead to the Dark Fortress and then gate back. That is a very good question. And those scavengers will clear that place out for us later and take care of all things. Right. Dark Castle. Seven days with six long rests. Much further. The capital. Actually, no. Seven days, seven long rests. Okay. No. We will just fast track it to the capital. I shall keep doing that because we need to switch our spell back. The food. Fast. Why not? Hmm. Group of redeemers? An insect. It's by the acidic. Cause frenzy. Huh. This is a fancy loading screen. Look at that. Well, we're all we're still a bit battered from our fight. Ew, gross. Pilgrim. Ew, that thing is kind of nasty. <gasps> We're all surprised, so it's going to take a while. I don't know if my mic picked that up, but that was... I think someone just rode a dirt bike down the road. We're in the middle of the city. That... Pretty sure that that's illegal. Not that I care, but... You know. You've seen worse. Burned by acid. Take 1d3... You don't see D3s that often. Do your thing. Oh, these things are pretty beefy. Oddly enough, they're not resistant to acid damage. Huh. You'd think that they would be. Right. Fourth level magic missile. Okay. Two to each, why not? like that little spread. That was funny. Definitely shield. I don't want to know what pheromone spray does. Apparently it can cause frenzy. Okay. Now you should cast Spirit Guard. Actually, you can cast it at 4th level to do more damage. All you can do is hit because you don't have smarts. Still do a lot of damage, though. Look at that. Just double check. Yeah, you have your bullets. But still, 12 radiant. We do 4d8 radiant with spirit guardians. Clerics are fun. Clerics are quite powerful as well. Fishkis D and D does really love their clerics. There's a domain for everything. They give a lot of love to clerics. Wow, 20? Damn. And dead with the offhand. Gotta love it. I mean, realistically, what are you gonna do, huh? Just everything on this guy. You know, I wonder when, when I ever do my second run of this, when probably after they do their Sorcerer DLC, 
probably going to use a sorcerer, but not a wizard, because I bet sorcerers are a little more versatile. And again, wizards can be versatile too, but it's also magic missile every single turn, because it doesn't miss. It's just good. It's just really good. What can I say? Oh, 20. That's good. Mm. You Dang. can't win. Couldn't see that. That's a tree. Thank you. Thank you again. I love the ting it's making. This is funny. Oh. Killed it with spirit guardians. Thank you. You have advantage, so you get sneak attack. Hell well yeah. Struck. I'm still using poison arrows. No, no, I'm going to keep using them. Let's... I'll do it after the fight. Another miss! She missed, but still did damage, so... And of course that, the, uh... Spirit Guardians cleaned it up. Okay, Anton. Let's switch out your arrows a little bit here. Perfect. Also, I want you to put these crafting materials into the wizard's pockets. Please and thank you. Right. Oh, I see. Could have climbed up high if we wanted to. No, we just brute force it. Oh, you get these poison arrows back sometimes, huh? That's interesting. And that's all we can do. Yeah. Yeah, resume. We really do need to rest after all that. Those are those are kind of cool creatures, though. I had not seen those, but yeah, those are cool. We might hit more ambushes though along the way because we do have we are fast speed. Niala, I think maybe a dimension door instead. Yeah. That'll do. Let's go. No nope, presume. Right, so we have the thing to do in the Fortress of the Shield. I'm going to see if I can actually change. Nope, can't change the crafting, so it's going to keep doing that. Okay. Mm -hmm. We almost had an encounter, but they scurried away, apparently. That's good. That is good. Are you going to rest just outside the city? No. Perfect. Cool. Yes, because unfortunately, we are not going to get high enough if we get teleport. But we might be able to get teleportation circle. Maybe. I don't know how that would work in this game. We might be able to use it to go to any gate we know of. Or it might not be in the game. I don't know. We have to wait until we hit level 9 to see. That'll be the best, uh, the best look. Okay. Everyone got anything we want to sell? Put on Thorak. All the alchemy goes through her. How do you use this? I don't know. I don't know how you use these ones. I hope that we can use them. In, in theory, we should be able to use them how you use them in normal D&D, but probably not. Just read them.
dump all of these. Cool. Yeah, anything we want to put away? I know we want to take out the dagger, though. One of these. Where is it? This. The prime dagger. Thank you. Hmm. Back up to a lot of food. That's good. I mean, honestly, I'm just going to put that in there. We're going to need to... Uh, we don't need two scroll kits, but I don't want to throw it away, so I'm just going to put it in this. Anything for you? Mm. Could probably sell a couple of those scrolls, because we don't actually need so many. Mainly because our crown, we can cast... Revivify and raise dead with it. And we have the cleric. Hello. How may I help you? I don't actually know if we need to uh, have so many of them on us. Chalice. Gauntlets. Because we have two of them. You. I, mean, I don't even know if I'm going to use Contagion, but I'll keep it for now. Yeah, that. You. Actually, we're going to need to split it outside of this, so let's do that. I'm going to sell two and one of these. Yes. Keep wares. Here we are. Ooh, 640. That's good. That's very good. 2,500. Look at that. Now, we do have these potions we could buy. They are useful. Mm. You know, we could nab the scroll of lightning bolt. Because that is a useful spell. It's a little hard to use sometimes, though. To get correctly lined up. But when you do... I actually want to buy a whole bunch of these. Mm. Because we need them. Yeah. Fuck it. Whole bunch of alchemy and crafting ingredients. Use a bunch of money, but I don't care. Cool. Also, out of curiosity, we can now craft Frostburn Dagger. Which I think I will. It's a plus one dagger that does a D8 of cold. That is really good. We have... We can. We can make plenty of that. Well, we can make more of those. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Right. Quest board. Here we are. Turn in... Two or three quests. Created one... The Arcanum is, we're in Alliance now. Okay. The Collector. Oh yeah, that one. I don't really know, if, I don't care about that one that much, but... You might as well, I guess. Yes. We'll finish this one. Copperan has a gate, as does the Fortress. Perfect. However, well, I'm first going to give all of these to her. Just make sure where all the things went. 
all these hexagonal rings. I believe... I think I know what those are, but I'm just going to identify them first. They split them up amongst the party a bit, but it's fine. Just gems, yeah. A whole bunch of gems. So if we identify one, we should identify them all, correct? Let's see what they are. Oh, Ring of Poison Resistance. Are they all Rings of Poison Resistance? Hmm. Not amazing, but... I mean, I guess, for instance, we can put them on a couple of these. We're gonna probably sell... We'll, we'll keep one, we'll sell two of them. I mean, he doesn't even need it, he's a dwarf. You can probably... Actually, I'm going to take those off and put them in the, ch the, the chest. She can have one... Yeah. I'm going to put one in here. And we're going to end up selling the other. Pretty sure it said a ring of necrotic resistance, but... Hey, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, sell 88, that's fine. That's fine. Now, can we get rid of these entirely? Actually, maybe we should... Yeah, let's, let's do a quick short rest to... Sort of any attunement issues. Remove. Yes. Oh, there's another ring. I see. Ah. Uh. Okay. Yeah. There's the ring. We got four rings of poison resistance as well. That's pretty cool, actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll take it. Give her poison resistance. Well then. So everyone's good then. Everyone is sorted. Yeah. Perfect. So we'll just put these in the box. Cool. Very well. Let's look at this board real quick just to see if we get an extra cash. Now, all that is left... Him. Yes. This will finish our... Cleric's quest. The aposty... Aposty. I don't know. I don't know how you say it. Clear skies, Chaplain Ardent Fire. Clear Ardent skies? Fire. Did you bring peace to those troubled souls? Yes. All of them are with the gods now. And Amtan? Saved. He is with Arun. Many thanks. I will call his name during mass. May Aaron's fire warm your heart. Clear skies. Okay. That went well. My faith is my shield. That was the uh, achievement I got from that. Make sure didn't pick up any miscellaneous items again. No, okay. Did you get XP though? That's good. No, don't drop the bag of holding, please. Do not do that. Right. Well, to the gate then. Yes. We will. I'll try in this the last 45 minutes to an hour of the stream wrap up 
both of uh, these little mini quests, then we can zip back, sell, etc. And then we'll be ready at the start of the next stream to go after those gems. But I want to try to get these two little side quests out of the way while we're at it. Hopefully they don't take too long. But they might, you know, it's combat, probably. There's no easy way to get out of this place, so... Okay. No, what we needed was near here, yes. The Collector. The Ruin Outpost near Copperan. Over here. Yeah. It saved us a lot of time to travel, though, so. Probably a solid eight days. Travel. Fast. There's no difference between fast and normal. Okay. Um... Oh, I see. They're resting now. Frostburn, how'd you get... Oh, God. What is that thing? Grimblade. Okay. You got ambushed immediately outside of town. And it's this map as well, so it's going to lag the shit out of us. For whatever reason... This crossroads map really hates it. I apologize for the stutteringness. Uh, there's nothing I can do about that, unfortunately. It'll it'll be over soon. Right, so we just need to take care of these orcs as quickly as we can. And then we can get on. We might only have time for a while, but... Are you okay? Rude. Yeah, that definitely hurt. That, that sucked. Okay. Stab this, the assassin in the back then. Not nearly as impressive as his, to be honest. That, that camera angle for a miss. Right. Boom, 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 boom. Impressive move, my friend. <laughs> Two works dead, and that one on his way. Honestly, you gotta love Fireball. It's a staple of any wizard. Maybe not really, but damage dealing wizards at least. For sure. Heal Thorak back up. Heal yourself in the process. Because you are a life cleric. And then beat the shit out of him. And then just start running at him. Just Terminator run at them. Death approaches. Wow, that was a wide shot. Okay. Switch to your bow, I suppose. And... Shoot. Twelve damage. Not enough to kill. I mean, we're resting anyway, right? Fuck it. Get fucked. Victory is mine. Just bomb the hell out of them. What are you gonna do about it? 
Alright. Don't want all these random arrows, to be honest. Take a healing potion. None of these are remarkable arrows, though, so. Then let's look into here. Coin I'll take, food I'll take. Everything else we can leave. Also, the scavengers will take care of it for us. Every Everywhere we go and leave things behind, like weapons and armor, the scavengers go to them, and we can get at least a portion of the cost of them. So essentially, they do the looting for us of all this random stuff. Oh yeah, this place with the, the merchant. Merchant caravan. I don't remember what we need here. I think something about Imperial something or other. Sigil of the Imperial First Legion. Okay. Up there. Tells me exactly where I need to go. Oh. oh. So they saw us from there. Evil priest, berserker. Oh. Lovely. Okay. Let's start out with... Bless, bless, bless. Bless. Perfect. Delivered himself right into melee with us. I'm unbeatable. Okay, that's uh, 34 damage. Damn. You do good damage. We are at level 8 now, so we're starting to reach the level of. Yeah. Big damage. Hmm, I can't fireball. Sad. Let's actually get to a higher vantage point. Okay, can't trip them from all the way over here? Yes, I can. No shot, eh? 14. Not bad, not bad. You, my man. Bonus action, dash, get high. Because you do extra damage if you're higher than people. So you can probably one shot. Another yep. one bites the dust. Poison, piercing. You didn't even do your extra predator damage. Casts a spell. Oh, it's healed. Okay. Ow. Rude. Archmage. Okay. You started out with a level one, a level first level magic missile. Maybe don't call yourself an archmage. All right. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. It seems effortless. Right. I'll put the Guardian of Faith here. Well, that's probably actually not a good idea. That's probably a waste. Instead... Mm, yeah. Go big. Try wow. again. Shielded. Okay. Fair enough. Yes. You can just climb up this wall, will you? Gotta love it. 25 damage. Mm, yeah. Again. Bend the knee or perish. 23 damage. Perfect. Now you guys over here. Now I can do this. Twenty-five to the archmage, archmage, twelve to the priest. Not bad, not bad. I will take it. You dash. Oh, just hop over there. Yeah. Shot her between the little cracks in the wall. That was a pretty good, pretty good shot. Really, you're just gonna heal yourself? You got two, two natural twenties. Wow. 
that's pretty good. It doesn't do anything, but that's just, you know, impressive. Let's try again. Might as well. Big guiding bolt. Let's go. Fuck off. I must do better. Well, she's she's done nothing. Mm, yeah, please kill him. Nope. Well, don't even smite, because there's no reason. Okay. I could just keep indiscriminately fireballing over there, just like a Gatling gun. Or I'll magic missile her myself. Nope, that was a, that was a mistake. I realized as soon as I hit the button that she had shielded. That is my bad. You know, things like that happen though in D and D, don't they? Sometimes you just forget simple things like the shield spell. <sighs> yeah, whatever. Who You're cares? Impressively fit. We have to rest at some point anyway, so. We're going to end up resting on our way back to Copper on anyway. Long sword. Is it just a long sword? Yeah. Bolts. Pass without a trace. Hello. That is a. I don't think you can scribe it, but it is a cleric spelling. Well, actually, no, it's not, is it? No, it might be. It's a trickster cleric spell. But usually, it's a ranger spell. Yeah. That's right. Not a cleric spell. So, probably end up selling it. So we have no use for it. Oh, damn. Embroidered silk scarf. What the hell does that do? Well, real quick. Valuable item. Okay. Let's go back to the items on the ground. Let's go. Come on. There you are. Coin and a candle. Fireball scroll. Anton gets his arrow and the Colthanon quiver. Damn. Okay. That's uh and that's that's endless uh endless arrows, really. Not the insignia of the first legion. Very nice. Who grabbed the oh yeah. Dagger. Dagger to him. There you are. I don't know if it needs to be attunement though. Might be attuned in. Perfect. We're gonna keep that dagger around just because I like it. It's, it's nice, but yeah. He's got two very powerful weapons. Now if we can just get his longbow to be magical. I think it might be, have to be a two-mint. We'll have to see. No. It just generates arrows. Yeah. Kind of cool. We're probably going to get full up of arrows, though. Every hour it makes 20. Oof. That could become a bit... Uh, awkward. Our inventory is just going to be full of the things. But, let's go. Let's head out. Go back to Copperon. Yeah. We're going to have to rest on the way there, but then we can teleport... Right to uh, the, the dragon's tower. And we'll see about finishing that quest today as well. That will put us in a nice position, position for. Might as well go at normal pace. It will put us at a good position to. Uh, start the hunt for two gems potentially next week now let's check his inventory and see if we have to uh ditch the quiver
Once we have a magic bow, I guess it's also nice because it's a. Uh, it doesn't matter what kind of arrows we use. We can use basic arrows and do magic damage. We just need a magic bow in the first place. That's the main thing. Now. Okay. His inventory is not full of them. Good. Serpentine. Scarf. Right. We could sell stuff. I think we're going to wait until the end to sell everything. I think, yeah, down here. Down here is the way to the gate. You know, we keep have eight on us. I don't know. I, I think she's casting it, but it's not reflected. So I don't, I don't know if that's a bug or not. It might be a bug. So we keep getting aid, but it only increases our max HP. But she doesn't expend a spell slot to do it. So I don't know what that's about. Might be a bug. Might be a feature. I don't know. Of course, the game came, only came out of only was officially released what a couple months ago, a month and a half ago. Actually, no, not even. I think almost exactly a month ago because I started streaming it pretty much when it came out. This in the ruins around her fortress. So let's head down to the outer area. Yes. There is a lot of loading screens between these. There's no quick and easy way to uh, teleport in and out. There's sometimes a little bit, a little bit out of the way, but it does overall save a lot of time of traveling. Because traveling does take a while, especially when you keep getting ambushed every other second. It's free experience though, free gold. I'm going to guess the part with the new enemies is where we need to go. No, let's be smart about it. Although it is the middle of the day. They're going to have disadvantage on I don't like it either. everything. But. No, I'm not going to waste the scroll. However. Let's bless everybody. If we put him to this, what can you cast? Protection of evil versus good on yourself. <laughs> put you back to your right weapon. Anything you want to do? No, pretty much all your stuff is, uh, well, actually. Fuck it. Why? Let's go. Let's go in. Start this fight off. That's weird. Now. If we were to... Uh, bonus action dash. Let's get you up there. Because you do like be you like being higher than everyone else. Unfortunately, you're not gonna get sneak attack, but whatever. You do do extra piercing and a bit of poison from your arrow. Next level, you start doing poison always. I think. Mm. Cast spell. I mean, we're already concentrating. Guardian of Faith wouldn't work too well. Ah, how about... How about a spiritual weapon? Put him down there, even though... 
can't attack with him this turn because... I don't know. It's weird. Unless I'm missing something about how to do that, but... Normally you can attack the same gun. Yeah. Nice little bit of shielding. Can't even see the bastard. Come on. There we go. Niala. There's one enemy down there. One there, one in here. I uh, don't suppose a fireball. No. Probably not. It would fuck everybody up, probably. Sad. So instead, just magic missile the shit out of him. Hmm. Do this one. Decent spread of damage. And I'm going to take the attack because you shield anyway, and just hover up here. Ooh. We dodged a natural 20 because of the sunlight. Gotta love it. Hold firm. You've endured worse. Thorak. Time to kill. Spider climb too. It's so weird. Natural 20. Yeah. Yeah. 35, 40, 53 points of damage in one attack. That's disgusting. I love it. Mm, let's hit him with sneak attack. Or you can miss. That works too. <laughs> Spiritual weapon. Float over. And hit. 7 damage. Pretty good. Mm, no one really needs healing, so... Just tag him with a guiding bolt. Why not? 23. He is so close to death. In fact, he's going to die next turn. Because he takes 10 damage from being in sunlight. It's a very good thing that we did this during the day. If this was at night, entirely different story. It's just, I like, I really love Acid Arrow, even though, you know, technically it's probably better to do Magic Missile because it doesn't miss, but I don't know, I, I've always loved Acid Arrow. It's a fun spell. It's aesthetically pretty cool, too. They always just disengage and just run. They just fuck off. They still hit you from here. Mmm, I mean, we're going to be resting soon, anyway. Good. Once we get back to the city, we're definitely going to rest, so... Why not? Burn him. Because we do want this to be over relatively quick, but, you know, we have like half an hour still, so... We're doing pretty good. Might as well... Oh, natural That's 20. Oh, yeah, you have, uh... Is it Divine Strike? Yeah. New level 8, so you do... Uh, oh, just like that. What was that? Okay. Return to the Fortress of the Shield. So this down here. This little, I don't know, pile of leaves. Ancient Letter. Testimony by an ancestor of Lord Danatar. And we have the insignia as well. Okay. Let us... In we go. Head back up to the tower. Return to Ker Kiflin. Turn in these quests. Sell anything extra. What... Any extra items in it. The chest, maybe see if we can't buy anything. Because we're going to have a decent amount of coin. I wouldn't say no to trying to get a magic item. 
maybe. Maybe at the very least we can check around. Maybe we can have we increased our standing enough to get a magic longbow? Probably not. We haven't done too much in that regard. Then again, couldn't hurt the check. Giving our rogue a magic ranged weapon be pretty useful. Then he doesn't have to rely on magical arrows to do magic damage. Mm. Time is it? You know, we might as well do it now while we are in a safe and free long rest area. So I know we can go to the palace, but the tavern's easier. Yeah, it's fine. Um, I'm gonna real quick check. We don't want to scribe anything, do we? No, we do. Yeah. Let's scribe a couple first levels into our. Or no, a first and a second. I think charm person's scorching ray second as well, isn't it? But charm person's a first, maybe. Yeah. Okay. Other way around. I had it confused. Sort. We are not high enough level to get put Contagion in our book yet. We're probably going to sell the extra scroll kit. Just get everything ready. Mm. How are we doing? We're putting this into the box when we get home, just because, I don't know, it, it's, a, it's a plus two dagger. I don't really want to just sell it. Well, well, then again, ooh. I mean, I know we're not getting 2,500 from it, but we're getting a decent chunk if we do sell it. And technically, we have a much better item anyway, so... I'm going to keep Create Food because our next step after we do all this back in town is to travel. It's a very good travel spell. Everything else... Find traps... I mean... Eh. You, though. Charm Person makes an ally an enemy. Could be useful. Could be very useful. For now... Actually, we can get rid of Spider Climb. I actually get to see inv invisibility. Because those Sorax that like to go invisible and then murder us. If we can see them coming, might be... You know, well, I don't know if we'll do anything, but... Yeah. Okay. Major Gate here... We did rest, right? Yeah. Okay. Just to be... Remember... Not crafting anything right now. Oh. Probably should have done that before the rest, but whatever. And just so we know, here, these are the good ones. Craft yourself... That. And he has a feat now, doesn't he? No, he has the other feet. We almost went with the Master Alchemist feet. But instead we went with Take Aim. To, uh... Get rid of any disadvantages on his ranged attack. Just in the off chance they happen. Because... Disadvantage negates sneak attack. Even if there's an ally adjacent to the enemy you hit. If you have disadvantage on the attack... Sneak attack is not happening, ever. That's one of the rules about sneak attack. Disadvantage, bad. I have played many a rogue, and DM for a rogue as well. Man, rogues are death machines if they can get, get it lined up right. Bounty board. Here. 
that'll wrap up two quests and give us, you know, a good bit, actually. We might... Oh, this might have increased it enough. Yes, yes. We got Pearl, Bracer, we got... Oh, oh. Hello there. Okay, first of all, let's not auto-equip anything. I wonder if there's a way to make turn that off. I don't know. You, however... Raise dead, we don't care about. We're going to sell that. Actually. But... You. Cone of Cold and Flame Strike. We're putting the Flame Strike to the Cleric. She can cast it next level. We're putting this in our spell book when we hit next level. For sure. The Cone of Cold and Contagion are really the only ones we don't have now from our scrolls here. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I'm gonna sell. Sell that dagger. Oh, identify. Yes. Identify. We already know what they are. This quest said they're a bracer of sparkles. Whatever the hell that is. Allows us to cast sparkle at will. Ah. We have that cantrip, I think, actually. We have no, we have light, shine. Actually, I don't know what sparkle does. It's a tumid anyway, isn't it? Oh yeah, no, we can't fit another tumid item in. In fact, how much does that sell for? Five hundred. We'll keep it. We'll keep it just, I don't know, sentimental sakes, maybe. <laughs> Stick that in the chest. We have all these random items now. Let's go here. Let's see if we got any... No. Two days, four days, three days, three hour, five days, three hour. Nothing new yet. No new coin. Okay. Then... I'll just track this just to make it the normal one. Let us talk to the Circle of Danatar. We reached Brotherhood, I think it said. Which I believe was what we needed to get a plus one longbow, which we might just buy outright. Deputies? We do require your services. Yes, longbow plus one. Kofanon chain. Hmm. Let's just look at all the other things. Scroll of blight. We could get blight into our book. Hmm. Five forty. That's pretty good. I'm going to grab the longbow. But, Light is a very good spell. And it would give her a damaging 4th level spell. Actually, she has one if she prepares it. I'm not going to do it for now. No. Probably when we hit 10th level, we'll really go around and see what we can get. Because 10th level is the cap. What we're able to buy. Not buy. Level. We Deputies? Tenth is the max level in this. We game. do require your services. At least as far as I've been told. That might not be true. They might have changed that since release, but nah. I'm just gonna sell that. Basic poison, sell those arrows. Mm. Yeah. Just sell random stuff to you. I mean, we don't use the crossbow. <laughs> hmm. 
mean, we don't need her to have torch because she can cast light. Do these weigh anything? Yeah. You know what? Yeah, let's sell some of these bolts. Hmm. Yeah, that's good. You, there's a ton of stuff in your inventory, but... May as well keep that. There... I mean, really, it's just all crafting ingredients. We could get her a plus one quarter staff for no reason whatsoever. Give her that candle. I don't know why you have that. Oh, that's why you have the candle, because we can't actually sell it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Is that all? Let's do one last... Oh, click to open quick shopping. Was that always there? I don't know if it was. Whoever, if... I don't know if it was added or not when I started this game. That's a godsend. Damn. Thank you for that. Let's get Expeditious Retreat. Just so that I want to... I actually want to try to add as many spells as I can to our book. I wonder if there's an achievement for that. buy a bunch of random crop. Yeah, we can buy extra spell books if we have to. That is amazing. Quick sell or quick buy thing. That is a lifesaver. Here. Read it just because. And you... Let us, before we go, scribe one hour. Expeditious Retreat is a pretty good spell, actually. Color Spray. Kind of useful. It's a cone of potential incapacitation, I believe. Although it's kind of like sleep. It gets not really as... It's not really as good later on because it's reliant on the health of the creatures but it could be useful especially since we're still running into just large numbers of low health creatures it could stop like five orcs i bet if i kept cast it at a higher level in fact let me look at it wizard spade Color spray. Oh, it costs blindness. Interesting. Costs. It's a cone. Looks like three. I don't know. D six. Maybe in every slot above first is two two sixes. Yeah, I mean, you get like nine D six worth of hit hit points in a cone I cast at a fourth level it's not bad oh cool ritual what's ritual not a lot of ritual comprehend detect identify in fact I think those are your only ritual spells detect magic silence Silence is a ritual. Hmm. And out of curiosity, yes, you can. You can ritual. But you need to have it prepared, I see. That's right. Wizards can ritual cast from their book, but you can ritual cast from prepared. So maybe you should actually get detect magic at some point. Okay. Well. That was uh, fun. That actually went pretty well, this session. We had no annoying-ass fights. We really are doing pretty good. We have a lot of quests done. We hit level 8. We're almost halfway to level 9. And we're well on our way to getting two more gems. We have 3 out of 8. That puts us at 5 out of 8. Which is exciting. So... 
This is the last stream of the week, unfortunately, but I will be back on Monday with more Darkest Dungeon, which will be killing a boss in that. Potentially two, at least one. We'll be killing, I think it's the Inkoet Flesh, I believe it's called. But yeah, thank you all very much for joining me, all those that watched and all those that will watch. And have a good day. Bye-bye.